We're live? Uh oh yeah, we're live, baby. That's uh oh, yeah. You guys just missed it. Uh, Dave was regaling us with the final countdown, and uh, he clipped his mic so hard that uh, that Skype muted him uh, on its own. I'm glad we're live because I'm about to burst. Okay, that's something uh, I didn't okay, want to hear. Great. Uh, <laughs> okay. <laughs> All right, uh, this is the last beer meet for a little while. I'm really excited to get to it, even though I'm meeting my old nemesis, Honey Brown, here. Thank you guys for joining us. I hope you're having one hell of a Saturday. Uh, and welcome to Beer Me. Hello, Saturday. everyone. Shay, welcome. do your thing. Oh, yeah. Uh, <clears throat> fuck it. We'll do it live. That's right. This is not Damn pre-recorded, it. and hence, we're walking a tightrope here. Who do we got? Uh, we got Rusty. We got Robin. DL. Gawkin. Robin already donated $14 for the beer barrel. Oh, my goodness, my gosh. And thank you so much, Robin, thank for the you. uninitiated. Thanks, the beer it. barrel really is how we uh, keep this little uh, show going. Jake, fucking rights boys. Clinton Erlinston is here uh, enjoying a delicious Colt Great 45 name. sitting in a plastic chair in my living room on my clothes. Uh, I was in the dishwasher and my dishes soaked in the bathtub. Living the dream. Yes, you are. <laughs> Uh, Robin go, Noble's Clint. got a 12-pack a of Labatt Blue going to keep with you tonight with Labatt Blue. Good good God, oh, my God. Good, good Adam Snow is here. Liam Winfield is here. I haven't seen the TikTok of Glenn Livett yet, Gawkin, but I am excited to, and that Glenn Livett does look uh, delicious. Zach said, ate some burgers. I'm paralyzed. I don't know how those two are related, but – oh, and then he says, oh, shit, from I'm the burgers. Gotcha. Daryl says, we're getting that extra shotgun. Adam L. is here. Guys, again, thanks for joining us. Let's get this movable feast underway. Okay. Um, Sh- we're going to do things a little Jurassic bit Park. differently. Shout out to Jurassic Park, The Lost World. Uh, we're doing things a little <laughs> bit differently tonight. What we're going to do is we're going to try each of the four beers, and we're going to give those beers a rating, overall rating out of 10. Downability is going to be the fifth category, and it's going to be up to you guys to tell us which beer you want us to shotgun. So once we go through them all, you let us know which one um, you want us to shotgun. That's what we'll do. And then we'll crack our favorite one for final grade to wrap it all up. So wrap with, it that up being, put a baseball. with that being said, we've already decided the running order of things, as you can probably tell with the uh, the scoring cards that we have going on. So without Hell further yeah. ado, let's kick things off. You guys ready? Uh, I'm so ready. Calling you by the name of the beer? Yeah, yeah might as right? well. Let's call, it, let's call it. Let's call it. get the fuck out of here with that. But, but Gawkin said Budweiser Nitro. Get out of here. Uh, mm-hmm. All right. You guys ready? Yeah. Three, yeah. two, one. Sleeman, Sleeman Clear 2.0. Clear 2.0. 2.0. You think after 2.0. 45 of these fucking uh, remote episodes, we'd be able to sync up our audio, but nope, still not. 2.0. I was just watching you guys to see what you guys would say, and then I followed suit. So. All right, that sounds good. 2.0. It's 2.0. Sorry, Dave, Why what is, is it? 2.0, though? I don't see, understand. First of all, great question, because it, it makes me think that it's a 2% beer. Yeah, yeah, same. It's but not. It's, it's a 4% beer, which isn't bad. Uh, so our, so um, right away, it kind of looks like uh, like a chart. Like what kind of chart? Like something you'd see in geography class or English? Yeah. What do you mean? What do you mean? It's it very like, shiny. It's meant to be very – it's like very reflective. It's like, it's like no, something sorry, you'd see on the chart. outside of a space station. It, it looks like yeah. duotang. It looks like duotang paper. I don't know. Yeah. Right off the bat, Dave, you're do you out mean? to fucking... I don't I have no idea what you're talking about. <laughs> line paper. Like, line paper. Like, school paper. Are you Where talking... Is the, just because of these four lines? Because of these yeah, lines? Yeah, it just reminds me of... It reminds me of school or something. There's three... Okay, no, I there's, get it. It's blue. It's blue, that's why, right? There's three blue lines, the same color as all 30-some lines you find it's on cool. line paper, and then you get doing things from that. It's very difficult. <laughs> okay. Uh, um, massive yeah. nutrition label. Um, that's the last thing I want to see on a beer, by the way. Yeah, but that's I classic. See this. You know, any light beer, it's always going to have that on it. I How do you so get much. protein out of this? There's, you get one gram of protein from oh, this beer. fucking right oh, on, sweet. man. So throw if out, I had 16 of these, I'd have my daily protein intake. Throw, out, throw out the protein <laughs> shakes and just get this in me after a good workout. 80 calories, too. That's pretty – that's low. 80 calories is is – Whoa, how do they manage that? I don't know, but this is something that's very interesting to me because Michelob Ultra is our most hated episode, and we bagged on that because it's, what, like 40 calories less than a regular beer? Yeah. This is, like, less than half the calories of a regular beer at 4% yeah, is, alcohol. Yeah, what What do they hire sci- new scientists? They Sleeman? must have. Yeah, they yeah, must have Sleeman had. scientists. They must have had the grandchildren of the Manhattan Project on the yeah, case this is like, because – and like, can we talk about? Ta- we can talk about everything. Oh, we're we? talking about all of it. We're talking about all of it. Yeah. Oh yeah. Shit. It tastes pretty good too. 
It actually tastes like a 5% beer, so that's kind of weird. Uh, it kind of tastes how the can looks. It like bright metallic y. Yeah, yeah. Oh, think... it does taste metallic y. Do you know what I mean? I yeah. Ah, oh, fuck. I really get that now. I wasn't it, getting it, that before you said it. It, it, it tastes like there's no alcohol in it almost. Yeah, it tastes like tonic water. Or sorry, yeah. uh, it tastes like bubbly or, or yeah. like a yeah, tonic, yeah. tonic bread water. Like if, yeah. if, if bubbly came out with a beer flavor, like you have cherry, yeah. you have blackberry, you have peach, you have pineapple, you have orange, you have lime, you have grapefruit, you have lager. Lager flavored yeah. bubbly. Yeah, I get yeah, no beer is... taste whatsoever out of this. But I, I don't get a mind little bit. I get like worn out beer. Honestly, this tastes like... like my uncle owns a boat and he has a 36 pack of this and we're just going and soaking up the sun and getting pissed on his little tiny dinghy. No, you know what it tastes his, like? It tastes um, like you opened your fresh beer and it's pouring rain out and all the raindrops were going into the beer. Oh, like, yeah, this is rainwater beer. Yeah. Like rainwater beer? Like, like you're collecting the rainwater in a barrel. Haven't you and ever had you a beer that? outside in the rain and then you're like, oh, yeah, there's some and water. And then you get water mixed shit. in with it and it kind of dilutes it a little bit and you get yeah, that. Yeah, that taste. is 100% what this tastes like. I yeah, almost drink exclusively in the rain because it really feeds the depressive side of things. Like if I'm really feeling low, I'll crack a beer. I look outside; it's pouring rain. It's not enough to go to the window and look at the rain. I have to think I go stand in it while I sip my drink. You've never you had a fun rain. Your rain beers are the bomb. Of course, I've had a fun. Yeah. it's like it's like you don't think I've gone camping before. Of course, I've I've had a rain beer. It's fantastic. It's well, great. How come you don't know the flavor we're talking about? You fucking asshole. Well, no, I get what you're saying. It tastes like very like like very pure water. Like you're collecting rain water into a barrel and then you filter it and you make a beer out of it. Yeah, it tastes very. It tastes like like Dasani. It's like it's like you made a beer with Dasani. Well, yeah, for me, it was more like the water dilutes the beer, so you're not you're yeah, losing you know. the beer. Oh, I see what you're saying. Yeah. I see. Like, okay, so you're not getting the full lager flavor because of the rainwater that's got into your already existing. Yeah. Ah, yeah. It's like yeah. if you're at a music festival can, and you're waiting in the rain. The Did you say a music festival? Do I look like the kind of guy that's going to go to a fucking music festival? Uh, well, concert? You molly poppin' son of a bitch. No, I'm hey, gonna... music festival, there's a wide variety of musical the accents. The closest I've come to a music festival is going to see Bare Naked Ladies at the Malkin Bowl at Stanley Park. That's the closest I've come. Uh, that's, that's, yeah, you might get kind of the feel You there. know, I've been to that fucking thing, place, Malkin yeah, Bowl. I've seen, that place is pretty sweet. You've never been or you have? No, never been there. Live here oh, my highly whole recommend, year. especially if you're in the front row watching BNL do, do their thing. Oh, tremendous. Oh! I I, uh, I was gonna go there one time for movie night. They do movie night there too. Or yeah, you they do. See what was on that? What was on the? Uh, what was on the schedule? Back to the Future. Okay. Ooh. Okay. Okay. Yeah. Classic. You know what I yeah. can't stand? I can't stand about theaters though. Is like all of the screaming and the the talking and the cell phones. So there's no way I'm going to that kind of thing to enjoy the movie. Like you're going for the ambiance, which sounds terrible to me. Yeah, uh, yeah. Everyone has like uh, picnic blankets uh, down. They're eating fucking popcorn, or they they brought dinner or potato salad or some sort of fucking. And, and there's you with your shirt off, just crushing Sleeman two point underneath the tree. <laughs> yeah, or I'm just running around, I around a, you. A, uh, my comfort. I'm getting jacked off under a comforter. Okay, all right. I mean, yeah. I think that's probably <laughs> no, just... people are gonna be able to no. notice that. And that's why you're not alone around playgrounds anymore. Uh, Gomi just donated forty dollars to the beer barrel. Gomi, Ooh. thank you so much. Thank Holy boats. Gomi, you're our homie. Gomi you, is Gomi. our homie. Um, um I don't know. Go the the... More... Oh yeah, you're gonna. No, no, go you're ahead. What were you gonna say? The more you think about it, I was it? gonna say the more I drink this, the more I don't know if I'm the biggest fan. I, I think it's a little like meh. It's kind of not not what really smooth. It's pretty smooth. It is smooth. It's got but a good I still carbonation. Get some of that tonic y shit when I don't know. Honestly, I like everything about it except the name. The name sucks. Well, hey, Shay, let's let, let me throw let me throw this at you. Yeah, yeah, please. <laughs> <laughs> if you had to drink a low calorie beer and still want to get uh pissed, would you think this was good? I would probably go with Bud Light though over well, this. And hang on. Yeah, a so okay, see, there you go. And isn't yeah. the jury kind of out on that one? Because we've had beers before. Where we'll have three, four, five, and we're like, this. I'm not feeling anything. We could have five of these maybe, and we don't feel a thing. I felt it from Bud Light over. Yeah. Coors. No, no, no. I mean this one specifically. I think Coors Light doesn't get me pissed at all. I can have like ten of the Coors Lights, and I don't feel I'm a thing. Getting a Coors Light vibe from this. Yeah, not it's a, a little bit thing. kind of the water, the water taste that Coors yeah. Light has. Do you know what I mean though? I'm getting like. My partying days are maybe behind me, and now I'm just I'm having a good time. I'm throwing the frisbee. I probably have to drive later. So I'm gonna have you have a, a one year old. Yeah, yeah. No, yeah, I mean it's just I think like I a have new a, family life. 
Yeah, I think I have a couple kids at this point. You know, when I have a when I when I have my first kid, one years old, I'm still trying to cling on to that past experience. You know what? Though I think that's oh, yeah. not true. I think people that have I I've noticed from friends that have one yeah. year olds, they aren't drinking these. They're drinking harder but stuff. Bad blues. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. No, I I understand what you're saying, but I, I, think, I think I think with your first kid. With your first kid, you're still trying I, to I hold on to what you're drinking before. Your second kid, Ooh. you switch to these. Your third That's kid, it. you're like Labatt Blues all the way. Yeah, you're right back. Because your fourth you kid, it's the hard liquor. It. You realize what you can handle, and then you're like, oh, I can handle parenting and going back to the good stuff. Oh, I yeah. was using I, – I meant like as a medication tool. But yeah, or you're proud of yourself for getting everyone that no, far. Or you're like, oh, oh, this is well, not – That's, that's when they're moved out. I guess you're yeah. right. You get to the third kid, and you're like the first two. Nothing happened to them. They're fine. I didn't break them. Yeah. You're like yeah. I'm. I'm switching back to to TNT. So straight back to the cocaine. <laughs> okay, you're or switching to TNT right after your divorce settlement. Uh, I'm going to the comments real quick. I'm just gonna skip through these. There's a lot, guys. Oh, uh, Liam you. says Dave's That's mic fun. hits me like a freight train when he gets close to it. That's true. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, Liam. I always do that. I make a mistake here. How's that? I don't know if they've discounted the cream ale. Moisty Taco, what's going on, my friend? Uh, Zach says this is my favorite out of the pack. Well, we're, we haven't even tried the rest yet. Whoa, um, that's Liam. Oh, like God. that, I get on my dinghy. Uh, Adam says it tastes like beer that has gone flat, but then out through a soda stream. Okay, yeah. Uh, yes. that's, that's, that's 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 true. Yep. It's, yeah. Uh, Liam says, trust me, Trev, music festivals are kind of crazy. It's fun to see bands, but not when you want to piss or poo. I'll take that in mind. I'll take that in your Oh, yeah. You can't. Yeah. If, you have to poo, if you have to poo, you have to leave. Okay. Uh, good to know. <laughs> and again, not an issue for me because I won't go to a music festival. Ryan says, tastes like your mom's fruity drink without the fruit. Kinda. Yeah, it tastes like the base oh, level yeah, where you yeah. start adding like fruity stuff to it. Yeah, hell yeah. Ryan says Bill Cosby in a can is th is what this is. I don't uh, know uh, if I want to delve too much into that, but okay. I don't know what that means. I don't feel drowsy. What's going on? Uh, Liam says, shout out to the parents who let their kids take sips of their beer. Hell yeah. <laughs> shout yeah. out to those parents. Yeah. Um. Okay, what are you guys going to give us one out of ten? What are you thinking? What are you feeling? I don't know. You know what? Oh, Shay, you go ahead. I've, I don't know. I just find this kind of run of the mill. Like you said, it kind of tastes like the can and rainwater <laughs> sifted through. <laughs> <laughs> um, ah, I might give this a nice, solid, soft five out of ten. So oh, soft five, five out of ten. I, I solid say, but soft. I have to say one thing: is that uh, when you think about how it stacks up to other low calorie beers, it's not. I've, there's better tasting ones. Yeah, yeah. There's better tasting low calorie beers. Like what? Yeah. Bud Light. Bud Light. That's not a low calorie beer. Well, what? It's lower than normal, right? Oh no, no I guess it's like a hundred calories. No, no, like 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 light beers aren't necessarily low cal beers. No. What? No, you if know, you uh, Michelob Ultra, you're going with like uh, that's a low cal. But like just because oh. just because it's light doesn't mean it's low calories. We had another fucking low cal one. It didn't Interesting. Eat? Might have been a gluten free one, like Omission or something. I don't know. But oh I shit! Think... You mean actually for a low cal, then it's okay. That's what I'm talking about. Eighty calories I'll and and four percent. I'm thinking this is pretty damn good. Oh, yeah. I'm, I'm going with a 7 out of 10. 7 out of Crazy. 10. Okay. Look at that. I think it just tastes like water. I wish. It, I mean, <laughs> but, Shane, yeah. not a bad thing. Like, can you imagine having this on the houseboat? I like, feel like 11 o'clock in the morning, else. you're cracking a beer, getting ready to play some beer pong or something. This is a great option. It's an option, but it's one of my last options. Okay. Well, it's okay to be wrong sometimes. I mean, in your case, uh, well, most of the uh, time, but that's you. fine. To each his own. Um, Honestly, the name and the look, I don't love. Uh, I'm right there with Dave. I'm going to give it a 7 out of 10. Overall, not too shabby, especially for a low-cal 4% beer. I mean, I mean, Sleeman, I was, I'm not going to lie. I was expecting a lot worse. So this is actually not bad. I, I would definitely – I'd buy a 12-pack of Bud Light, 12-pack of this if I was going on like a, like a camping day drinking trip. This would, be, this would be on my list. Whatever, man. Okay, fuck you. <laughs> You're entitled um, to your opinion. Okay. The that... I, I got to tell you guys really quick, little little, little sidebar. The yeah. Toronto Maple Leafs just tied the game up with a few minutes left in the third period to go to overtime. All right. So oh, and what's could... the series right now? Three, three, two, Toronto. You know what's they great? You know what's great? Oh. When you're when you're live streaming a show and then you're talking about another show that everyone has complete <laughs> and full access to that they should go watch. And you know what else is great, Dave? When you're telling us that info, <laughs> you go else. right on your mic like that, like Liam said. So that's. Uh, oh, sorry. Yeah. Okay. Sorry. <laughs> I only said it because it's the playoffs. Um. Okay. That brings yeah, us to the second so. beer. That is Pier Point IPA. Now my beers aren't that cold, so I have some in the freezer. I'm gonna swap this Pier Point IPA that I have in front of me with the one in my freezer. You know, like kind of like how they do on cooking shows or on TV uh, for like morning 
morning news. They like they're like yeah, you they, bake they, this they for forty minutes the, and they have one out already that's been baking for forty yeah, minutes. Yeah, and then yeah, then they're ready. Yeah, I love that. I just love when they do that. Yeah, you love. <laughs> you seem like a morning news kind of like you're their demo. Like you would turn it on, you might uh, make yourself a cup of coffee, and then you would just be watching them bake. I don't know an apple pie for Thanksgiving. Oh, I adore it. I just adore it. Thank you very much. Thank you. My Vanna White uh, just delivered me a a, a much oh, colder nice. Pierpoint IPA. No, I, oh, is it, so the IPA is next. Uh, the IPA is next. We went over this. We went yeah. over this minutes before we started. Sorry, I and I, can, I guess I can see it on Dave's backboard. Backboard. Yeah, you can, yeah, you can see it everywhere. Oh, you can see it right here. Yeah. All Thanks, right. man. This is Pierpoint IPA. Pierpoint. That's what Where we're doing is now. Pierpoint? I don't fucking know. Do I look like a geographist to you? It says, sit back, relax, and enjoy this <laughs> yeah. easy drink IPA with a full character either. dominant <laughs> yeah. Oh, shit, hang on. Sorry, 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 Dave. We were talking you over here. It doesn't matter. You know what? Uh, you know what? All right. I'll Thank say you. it then. The lighter, it says, the lighter side of an IPA. Sit back, relax, and enjoy this easy drinking IPA with full character, dominant citrusy hops, and a crisp, refreshing finish. Sounds right up our alley. Not. Why didn't they say <laughs> shit on the clear 2.0? Um, so there's some, there's some people right here jumping off a pier. They look happy. That's so a dock. That's not a pier. That's someone's private dock. Okay. Sorry. It's a dock. First of all, it should be called dock point, which is a great, uh, a great, uh, sexually charged magazine dock point. That's not a fucking pier or it's a, it's a grinder makeout spot dock point. Um, uh, second ooh. of all, they're either happy because they got a day off or they've decided that they're finally okay to end things. So this is it. This is their last little oh, plunge. It does kind of look a little suicidal. I uh, yeah, that. I think the meteorite's about to hit and they said, it actually, fuck it. it. It looks like this person here was pushed by the person yeah. that's higher up. It looks like they were shoved doesn't in. Doesn't it look like the wa lake water has an oil spill? There's like oil building up on the sides of the land. <laughs> yeah, it kind of looks like that. <laughs> What the hell? Look at the oil pooling on the on the. Oh yeah, you're the... right. Yeah, yeah. This, this looks is, like uh... this looks like an eco disaster. Yeah, so yeah these this people is, are uh, like, very modern. Fuck it. I mean, I kind of like how small the artwork is. I like and I like the Sleeman on the side of the can there. What's the percentage on this guy? It's an IPA. It better be higher. Five point five. Five point five percent. Daryl just donated ten dollars to the beer barrel. You handsome bastard. Thank you so much, Daryl. Thanks, Daryl. Thank you, Daryl. Uh, Daryl's drinking uh, the pack along with us. Hey, look at this shit. There's a dock by itself on the thing, just for no reason. Just an empty dock. What? Oh, this that is, looks so silly. This is it's the, the exact is, same dock on the from the front. It's like the exact same one. Yeah, this is. Yeah, a, it's like. It's like they put the, the back dock of the side. when you go to their funeral. This is on the back of the the pamphlet you get. This is the back of the booklet at the funeral. This little oh yeah right here. yeah yeah it'll be the dock. Yeah, it's like yeah, a little so... Easter egg. It's like a little Easter egg for those that are in the know. Do you know like some people are going there and they don't know how they perished. They just know that it was like something to do with water, and then they have this little pier on the back. Yeah, the, dock, the dock's oh almost like a, a, a watermark. It's a little wink and a nod to those closest that know exactly what Bill and Susie went yeah, through. Yeah, just there. to make light in the mood, make people laugh a little bit. Yeah, I gotta say, love the color of the water, mm -hmm. I, and it matches the Sleeman. Love that. I'm a big fan. Yeah, that's cool. This is uh, yeah, I like the artwork better on this can. It actually says something. I love the artwork know? a hell of a lot more than I love the taste. Uh, yeah, the taste is just, I don't... The uh, taste is awful. Also, it says Pure Point 2.0. Sorry about that, guys. Let me fix that. It's supposed to be IPA. The taste uh, it's, is okay. So the, the, the aftertaste is a little punching me right in the taint. I mean... Yeah, I just don't understand why... It, it, it's doing nothing for me. I don't even get where it's coming from. I do like the strong taste to it. The strong alcoholic taste. That That's a little fun in my mouth. Kieran yeah, just donated get, $10. Uh, Thank you so much, Kieran. Um... This is not a summer tasting beer to me. This to me is this would be like if we were in a, if this was yes. Yes, this tastes like an October beer to me where everything is dying, my mouth is very bitter and dry. Okay, yeah, I got I got I got to like put on an extra layer because of the chill in the air. Um the, the chill in the air. Oh yeah, that was like Dr. Susie and unintentional. You said that yeah. very because yeah, of good. the chill in the air. I said it very what purposefully. Like you were like you were doing an audio book because of the chill in the air. I recorded a couple auditions today, so maybe that's still uh, uh, floating around. Uh, yeah, well, get but, that out uh, of your fucking. Yeah, get mind. it out of my system. A couple of these, and it'll be no problem. It'll be long gone. I, yeah, I you'll be throwing a chair out the window. I, I feel like that doing that with I, yeah. I feel like there's no way on a hot summer day. Okay, am I 
am I taking a, am I cracking a six pack of this by the by the by the not a fucking the chance. No way. Yeah. No. no yeah. Oh. Although this mixer pack doesn't really seem that summer. It just seems like it's just a bunch of Sleeman beers put together. Yeah. Exactly. I well, I mean, hang on a sec. To be fair, we've only this is only the second. Let's yeah, wait but I and see. see. Yeah, I see that the future ones. Honey Brown? Yeah, the Honey Brown is little... total fucking no way. No no fucking <laughs> shot am I doing that in the summer. The I don't want to do it any time of year. When Isn't we get to Honey Pilsner Brown. Theme? A lot of water talk. A lot of water theme in this. Well, that's because it's yeah, got... I guess, it's, oh, I guess that's the summer. Oh, you mean right? they're doing that. Yes, 100% they are. Yeah, Adam yeah, Snow with the $6 donations to get us to the beer barrel at 80 bucks. Oh, wow. Already. That's an oh, extra thank shotgun. You. Thank you so much, you guys. Holy boats. That's crazy. You guys are crazy. Um, yeah. What does this taste like, though? I don't know. This tastes like this tastes like all of my friends are going quadding, and there's no room for me, so I'm left at home making them lunch. Tastes like you went head first off your four wheeler into a bush. <laughs> I did that once. So a pretty buddy awesome. Of mine, I did that once. A buddy of mine had a. I think it was a trike. It was a three. You went head first into a buddy of yours. Yeah, I went head first into a buddy of mine. Then he went head first into me. Uh, speaking of docking. <laughs> Um, uh, had, it was his, it was his uncle's backyard. Okay. This story already. It was his uncle's his backyard, backyard and he had a trike and then he's like, I've never ridden one before. And so he's like, yeah, this is how you throttle it up. And you do that. And I just hit it. I gunned it. And I went, I, I, is mo- is it, you're talking I, about his dick. I, yeah. I'm talking about his dick. And then after I got <laughs> off, I, I got off his dick onto the trike. I got off his dick. And then, and then I, I gunned it right into a fucking hedge, destroyed the hedge. Oh, Whoa. Really? And how did you feel after that? I was killing myself laughing. It wasn't my fucking hedge. Did it feel oh, like you drank a uh, fucking North Point IPA? Uh, this is Pure Point, Point, not North Point. Isn't North Point a clothing <laughs> brand? You ignorant Sounds slut. like a golf course. I think it's a golf course. North Face is a clothing brand. <laughs> this is punishing. Like, this is the kind of beer you, you... Speaking of, like, letting your kids taste a beer, if I didn't want my child to be tempted to drink beer, I'd give him a sip of this. Yeah, that's it, a good it, one. It, 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 it almost tastes like a gin and tonic, but a beer. Uh yeah and uh, God I think it tastes kind of like tastes how my like cat old IPAs smells, poured into one carbonated yeah it tastes like it tastes like if there were a bunch of IPAs in a flight and you poured them all into one glass and then you started drinking yeah it. yeah it, I'll just tell you it's this blend. much if I was a fan of IPAs I wouldn't be drinking a Sleeman I'd probably get like a, that's when you get like that's a fun a huge craft burn IPA. and you know yeah. what Sleeman you're welcome nobody I'm just saying <laughs> Sleeman I wouldn't it's too gen- you don't get this. IPAs. Yeah, I'd go for anything else but this. If I was an IPA like, fan, I wouldn't like be looking Budweiser. at this brand of beer. Fuck these no, guys. I'm fucking saying it's like Budweiser making an IPA. You only get you make you get IPAs from like craft breweries that like perfect them. Yeah, that's true. This is not. Yeah, it's, it's like it's Budweiser like, trying to make a nitro infused beer. That's what I'm talking yeah. about. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Burn that's, that. Yeah. I don't know what I'm gonna do with it, but I'm scared of it. I keep it over there under lock and key. I have like holy water at the ready in case anyone tries to open one. And I, and, and I like taunting Gawkin with it. That's funny. Yeah, I don't know, man. I don't know if this – it's not really smooth. It doesn't really taste that great. There's uh, definitely better IPAs. I'm going to go to – I'm going to go to the comments uh, real quick. Panama Red's here. Hello, my favorite Canadians. Oh, appreciate that, Panama. Thanks, Panama Red. Here. Robin said, not an attractive enough can to have on a houseboat. Oh, uh, okay. I went a bit too far back. Um, uh, Liam says, I like my IPAs to punch me in the mouth. This one punches you in the mouth and then pisses in it. Oh my god, yeah, it's I've not a good IPAs. punch. It's not a good punch in the mouth. Yeah, it's though. not a it's good not punch. I've one. had IPAs before that's like not my f- flavor, but it's still like good. You can be like, oh, this yeah. is fun. But this is something like yeah. if someone gave it to me, I would give it back to them. Do you know what I mean? Like, oh, here you go. I'm like, ah, oh, no. Yeah, shove that up your ass. Shove like, that IPA right wanna... up your ass. Liam says, yeah. based off Trev's yeah. face, it tastes like an ecological disaster. Yeah, you're not wrong. It, it does kind of taste like carbonating the water that this is this sludge is in. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Robin said, how much did Dave's brick wallpaper cost and where did he get it from? I want to do my dart room. Dave and I got that from Home Depot, I think, right? Yeah, it was like Actually, it was like 28 bucks. I looked on oh, Home cool. Depot's website. I went and picked it up and then we, I brought it to his place and we put it up. So, yeah, it was not expensive. It's uh, Home Depot. Yeah, I want my uh, uh, coffin to be covered in it. Rusty says, maybe oh, the artwork is good. symbolic. If all your friends were brewing hazy IPAs, would you jump off a dock? Yes, I would. <laughs> yeah, hell yeah. Oh. This kind of does taste like your buddy's like, hey, I made an IPA. Come over. Let's have some. This It, it, yeah. it, does, it doesn't taste like a pro- this is professionally done. It's not. No, not it, it feels like a generic yeah. IPA that a big company, a big uh, beer company shouldn't be making fucking IPAs. 
And you know what, Sleeman? You're welcome. <laughs> I think there's a reason. I think there's a reason you can only get this IPA in a in a in a summer selections pack, and they don't sell it on its own. It's yeah, because get it out yeah, there, like, get rid of they're it. They're trying to corner the craft brewery market, and you can't because it's, it's too generic. Yeah, well, and like, oh god, is that a market you want to corner? No, not really. Um, what do you? It gets worse as you go along. Like for yeah. re- reliability, this thing probably tastes like it's shit. Yeah, like most high school relationships, it's worse as you go. Adam says, "I don't hate the color on the pier point." Yeah. Yeah, oh, the colors are nice. The, colors the art great. works nice. Yeah, that that blue, that that uh, that sky blue, is it sky okay. blue? Okay, it's a good blue. Daryl says it tastes like the combination of all the final sips people leave in their beer bottles at a party. Yeah, but like a, yes, it does. A hundred percent. If all if the party was just like everyone bring your own craft brewery pack and we'll and we'll we'll split it, and everyone's in like Birkenstocks. And hats and vests. And then, <laughs> Birkenstocks. And then, and then Birkenstocks. I haven't seen a pair of Birkenstocks in a long time. Yeah, well, I tell you what. If you did, if there was like 18 people with Birkenstocks and you took a little bit out of each beer. Do you know what point. I uh, – it's people that wear Birkenstocks with socks. What are, what are you, you – Liam don't said like Ozzy people? Osbourne almost died during That's an 18 okay. crash in 2003. <laughs> I didn't know that. Uh, yeah, it's not okay. Adam no. Said, oh, Adam said pee-pee. Tastes like its nickname. Ew. It, or you can get away with it if you're wearing a fanny pack, too. Hey, if the rock can oh, wear a fanny okay. pack, anyone can. Okay, J- Jake said that's the one you shotgun tonight, you bastard. Oh. No. Do we she also says, I'm going to be in as I'm celebrating my sister's birthday. Hope you all enjoy the case of cold brewskis. Have an awesome Saturday night. Cheers. Hey, thanks, DL, and happy birthday to your sister. Hope she has a great yeah, uh, birthday. birthday. Is she old enough to drink? Cheers, Daryl. Cheers. Thanks, Daryl. Okay, let's rate this son of a bitch. Dave, what are you going to yeah, give? I'm done with oh, I just took like it. a pretty big one. Oh, 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 oh. Yeah, not not good, not smooth. No, it uh, sucks. I don't, I don't see the appeal at all. I don't think they should even they they dip their they dip their toe in the wrong pool. Yeah, 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 they did. They yeah. Uh, I'm Exxon going with Valdez. A, I like the 5.5. I'm going with a 1 out of 10. The oh, oh getting, the, when you the said I like the my 5. keyboard 5. in such a way that I can see all of the beer spray from months of doing this here. Spray. Uh, one out of ten for you. Okay. Shay, what are you giving it? Uh yeah, I do like that it's a little bit strong and five point oh, five, but it. I also hate the aftertaste. So I'm gonna give it a nice supple four out of ten. Supple. Oh, you're four. going you high. Four supple. That's still not like not great. Man. I don't know. Four is pretty high for this beer. There's no redeeming quality about it except looking at these two people and imagining that I'm I like the, the third artwork. just jumping into this disaster and never surfacing again. Uh, yeah, I know. I, Dave and I are synced up this week. I'm giving him a one. Well, we will until the next one. Uh, one out of ten uh, for this 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 uh, ecological disaster. What's up, RJ Money? What a great name. RJ Money. There you RJ go. RJ Money. Rossi says, remember the Always Sunny in Philadelphia where the pub's microbrew was a bunch of fallen soldiers poured together? Yeah, I do. And you know what? That's so incredibly true. <laughs> oh, man. Okay. Oh, yeah. no. Okay. Also, guys, we got to figure out beer barrel-wise. We didn't talk about this. Oh, yeah. Do we do, do, we do the beer barrel now? Or do you want uh, – because because downability is the last category. That's oh, I do. I, I would do it now then. So and then are we doing the, the first beer barrel is usually a beer that we're doing. Do you know what I mean? Yeah. So we're so, doing the honey brown? Well, I mean, I do I guess we can all pick our own beer barrel beers. Yeah, I guess that would make sense. I'm not doing for point. I'm not we doing all honey choose brown. They... I haven't tried the Pilsner yet, so that le- I'm gonna do the two point I guess. Yeah, I think I'm I'll doing just... the two I'm doing the two point oh. Yeah, yeah, I'll do, I'll that. do the two point because I don't want to I don't want the first hit of Speed River Pilsner to be downing it. No, I don't. We don't. We haven't tried it yet. Hell yeah, thirty one today, DL. And also, I'm not doing the nitro, Daryl. Do you guys know how? I don't think you guys know. I forgot to tell you guys. I was driving. I think I, I, made get it. I did. I'm getting the clear. I'm getting the clear point. Yeah, do uh, it. Yeah, the two point Uh, I was driving by my neighbor's place on recycling day, and they had a a, a cardboard box of nitro outside, Whoa. and I know immediately that they're terrible people. But do you think they were drinking it, or they're just gonna throw it out? That's a good point. I just yeah, assume man. anyone that buys it is a terrible person, which like that's terrible people. Did I, we we've <laughs> talked about this, but like I've seen it at the liquor store heavily discounted. No, it's insane. Me too. Like Twelve it's, packs like, of no that heavily it. discounted. Yeah, Adam says. I'm good. guessing the pilly will be unreal. I guess we'll. 
Oh, Robin says honey brown for down ability is my vote. Okay, well we're gonna we're gonna do we gotta do two more beers and then down ability oh, comes along. Oh, I got my keys already, baby. Yeah, uh, I'm gonna get close. a I'm gonna get a two point oh. Hang on, I'll see if Van away can bring me a two point oh. Hey, can you get me a two point oh from the fridge, please? That was oh boy. Jake, how dare you? I got my two point oh. Liam says based on the podcast, I shouldn't be surprised by your neighbors. Yeah, you're not wrong, Liam. Thank you very much. Uh, is this the freezer? Yeah. Can I get the fridge one? Oh my god, you're the Thanks. No, the, it's just I like it cold, but not too cold. And I'm shotgunning it. Do you know what I mean? I had a freezer oh, one. It's probably that one. I just if I'm shotgunning it. I like the fridge one better. Do you know what I mean? Is that does that make sense? Well, not to Dave. Dave, as anyone that watches Mario Kart, know Dave likes to chug his beer ice cold. And it has to be ice cold at all times. Oh, to me, it's like knives it's in my brain. Yeah, this is a perfect temperature. Cold, but just below room temperature. Thank you, Robin. Uh, well, mine's very cold. Shit. Maybe easy. Yeah, despite all evidence to the contrary, I think I am a gentleman. This is. I truly got the clear. Him. I got the clear as well. This is the beer bro one. You ready? Yeah. Oh, uh, God. God help us all. God help. Oh, I picked up some fireball today because I was worried if in case we hit a second one. I was like, I got fireball. No sour puss for you, Shay. I got Jameson. Oh, really? Wow, you really yeah. went hard. You really went hard in the other direction with that. I just don't like fireball. It's just it makes me puke. You know what? Fireball doesn't like you. Yeah. Well, that's fair. That's totally yeah. fair. It's like your eighth grade English teacher. Oh my god. Did she not like me? I don't fucking know. <laughs> I'm, I'm guessing think. not. My eighth grade. Not really. My teachers English hated teacher. me in grade eight. I was insane. Oh yeah. My eighth grade in English teacher was an uh, um, a nice guy. Um, I went to a private school for grade eight. <laughs> Actually, here's the thing. Well, never mind. I won't get into it. Shit. Wait. No. What? What? What do you mean? I okay. I went to school for grades one to four. I homeschooled five, six, and seven. Then yeah. when oh, I went yeah? to this private school, they were like, "Look." Because we like this private school did grades one to twelve, they were like some of the stuff he's like he's good for grade eight. Other stuff, it's grade seven. We're gonna put him into grade seven here. So I like redid grade seven at this private school. Yeah, that was like heavy into academics. Then my parents were like, "Okay, hey, we're not doing that school anymore." So I was like, "Well, I'm not fucking doing grade eight homeschooling." So then I went to grade <laughs> nine homeschooling, and then I went into high school. So I skipped grade eight. I never did grade eight. I did grade seven twice, then grade nine, and then into high school. <laughs> that's really funny yeah but when you, when you look back on those lower grades grade, they don't mean anything nothing means anything and then you're dead that's my that's no, the, I, but like uh, you could literally go to high school and start a grade 10 and and then they teach you the, all the stuff you need to know before you go oh to yeah grade. don't yeah oh don't i know it baby don't i know it all right you guys ready yeah uh yeah my hole is way too big but oh yeah we'll i know see. it is daryl <laughs> says i'm right there yeah. with you shay fireball's awful so you're in good company hey, Jay. thank you like it you can't do it i prefer jameson to burn my throat there's nothing you can do, shave your hole's too big. Oh. Uh, no corrective surgery. Okay, you guys ready? Yeah. Yeah. I hope. Oh, man. Yeah, whatever. All right, here we go. Uh, three, two, one, beer barrel? Yes. Okay. Three, two, one, beer barrel. Beer, beer barrel. barrel. Oh, it's so cold. Ah. Whoa. I actually had to stop because of how cold it was. Woo! <sighs> actually, holy, this is the first time ever that it's been too cold. What did you do, Dave? A fucking clear 2.0. Yeah, oh. I, I, it's like it's so fucking cold. You did? It looks like one of the other cans. Oh, I see. Oh, I think boy. I'm going to die. Holy shit. Oh, clear 2.0 is not good when you uh, you take it all at once. I thought it would be. I thought this would easily be the easiest. Oh, what the wow. Hell? Can I go amend my, my score? Oh. Yeah, I'm happy with of, my score. I had a bite of a hot pepperoni stick while I was getting the clear 2.0. What and is wrong stick. with you? You're Why about would to you shuck in a beer. You're like, you know what's going to be good in my, like, for, for the beer to hit in my stomach? A bite of a hot pepperoni stick. Yeah, be careful, man. Well, it's just there. You know what's in the bag and you're just excited that you see pepperoni? Yeah, well, put it away. Get out of your like when you're like 18 years old and you see a, a pepperoni stick. You're like, yeah, I'm gonna eat that. And then I'm gonna shock in a beer. No problem. I still get that feeling. Yeah, I get the I, feeling I, too, I, but I've I, the experience I, to go. I'll oh, wait. Every time I see a bag of pepperoni sticks, I, I it's like I I forgot that I had them. Pepperoni it's that, sticks, that man, a bag a bag of pepperoni sticks. Like, is there anything better? 
No. It's so damn good. I took the big had... bite too. I almost bit through the little ones. I almost bit it in the half. The whole thing. The whole thing. Almost. Yeah. A little bit of a nub left. Yeah, well, I, of, bet, I bet you could fit the whole thing down in one bite. Uh, of course. Based on your grinding well, you know, power. You know he can. Should have done that Robin said, aw, oh, Dave. When you try your best, but you don't succeed. Stuck in river. Why, why, why do you eat the microphone when you know? Like, I wish you could hear what we hear when you do that. I know. It's pretty fucking insane. Yeah, I did the, that on purpose that time. I know. But like, I don't think you'd even do it on purpose if you could hear what we hear. Adam said, I'm eating pepperoni sticks right meow. <laughs> Fix you. <laughs> Fix uh, you. Uh, yeah, there oh, it is. Fix you. Fucking cold play. Rusty, I prefer anything whiskey with a 75 to 100% rye on its malt bill. Hell yeah. Adam, sa- <laughs> Adam said going clear 2.0. That's a reference to the documentary on HBO called Going Clear. It's about Scientology. Highly recommend it. Ooh, I'm going to watch that shit. Highly recommend it. I'm going to watch it, it and then I'm going to join up. Me, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to join up, and then I'm going to go to Tom Cruise for Thanksgiving. Honest to God, guys, this is no <laughs> lie. If some Scientologist came to my door and was like, look, we we want you to join. You got to be hardcore, like in the paint, like Tommy Boy, oh, not the movie Tommy. Tom Cruise. And like you, can, then we'll we'll get you some small parts in movies. But eventually, five year plan down the road, you and Tom are 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 co headlining movie together. Sign me up. I don't even care. I even don't. if it means doing, doing unthinkable, so unforgivable things. Cruise? Yes, yes. Fuck my immortal soul. Get me into a religion for the here and now in terms of a movie. Hell, hell yeah, hell yeah. Okay, I see yeah. where you're, I your head's at. But, but then, what's the point of like? Aren't even, you gonna? Like, yeah, don't they make you film like unforgivable things and then? I've already used that against you, you know if you ever want to. Yeah, don't you have to like jack off? I've already filmed movies? so many unforgettable, uh, un- like unforgivable things that like, what's one more? Oh, don't, okay. Don't you yeah, you're untouchable. That's good. Briefcase and then throw said briefcase off a railroad bridge into the water. <laughs> I almost puked up my entire 2.0. Um, I don't see how that would be offensive to anyone. And the, and the briefcase has to hit the water and it and splash and then not get fully wet. And then it floats. Like, that's the remnants from the briefcase. Yeah. Right there. Right there. It has to be thrown from a railroad bridge, though. All right, on that why, note, let's why? go to Honey Brown Lager. Let's take the next... Oh, my God. This... Yeah. Okay. This 2.0 taken all at once... I my burps taste like pepperoni sticks, and I haven't had a pepperoni stick in like a year and a half. So don't I don't know what's it. going on with this, but I'm not a huge fan. Well, get ready for the next one, buddy. RJ Money oh. says if Shay is Chris Martin, then Dave is John Ross and Mayor of East Town. I haven't seen Mayor of East Town yet. Is it good? What's Mayor of East Town? It's a show on HBO starring what's her face from Titanic. Kate Winslet. Uh, Kate Winslet? Yeah, Kate oh, Winslet. Shit, Anyways, I love her. we're not talking about Kate Winslet. I said Kate Winslet and Shay checked his hair. She's not here, Shay. Don't worry. No. Um, God damn it. Okay, no connection. we're going to do. Uh, can that I pepperoni stick really didn't help the place? fucking thing. You're not looking too good, Dave. You're looking no, I'm like. No, I'm okay. I, I, I was Dave okay. Dave never looks too... good. How come you guys was... both look like a normal color and I look like I just saw a ghost every damn you did. time? The ghost has a pinky. Yeah. I, I look so. You know what? I bet I can fix this. Hang on. Let's yeah, there's see. definitely oh, correct. Yeah, get the saturation up. Yeah, how's that? Yeah. Is that a bit better? There it is. Yeah, that's great. <laughs> oh my god, that is. <laughs> Do I that's look funny. less? Yeah, yeah. RJ only has got that vampire that vibe. That Not anymore. I don't. Look at all that color I just gave myself. Are you that that guy looks like you have like a slight sunburn on your face. I like, did. I saw. Like I was, right I was out in the sun all day. Yeah, I was out. You're that non-tanner guy that goes from white to red, red to white. No, no, no. DJ Tanner, man. You tan. I'm a Tanner family guy. What? You know what? from Full House? The Tanner? Yeah, I know. DJ Tanner. Oh. Yeah, DJ Tanner. What's her name? Candace Cameron? Candace Cameron, yeah. She's uh, married to an ex-hockey uh, player. Okay. Huh? Can I get a Can I get a honey brown from the freezer, please? <laughs> How many times I have to can ask, right? Like, come on. Oh, my Whoa. God. You you, uh, this isn't 1964. She's going to kill you. This is... Hey, what's old is new again, Dave? Do my Candace dishes. Candace Cameron Burr, thank you. She might throw this in my head. Yeah, Candace Burry. That's uh, Pavel Burry's brother's Oh, man, uh, brother. nice and cold. Oh, oh Pavel Burry. Burry. I remember uh, that player. Shit. All right, you know what, guys? Just shut up. Who cares? This is a uh, honey brown lager. Let's go. Wait, I got to check the game. I'm not looking forward to this. No, stop I... checking the fucking game. 
It's it's two two with ten minutes left nice, in overtime. Liam. I, I should maybe change it to my war zone. Uh, oh yeah, you're near a Toronto Maple Leafs guy. Wait, can I can I can I ask can I chat? Can I ask a question here? Can I ask a question? Dave's first team is the Canucks. They're out now, so now he's cheering for the Toronto Maple Leafs because they're his second team. Is that kosher? Is that what everyone that follows sports does, or is that like yeah, considered? I, I, is that considered like uh, uh, egregious? Blasphemy? Yeah, is I that considered so. like? Because a lot of hockey fans would be like, no, they're both from Canada, so okay, you know. Daryl says that's fine. Okay, okay, yeah. To me, it just seems like if your team's out, who cares anymore? What? You can like more than one team. Exciting. Adam Snow says yes. It's yes to what though? I think he's saying it's fine too. All right. Okay. So right off the bat, hate Honey Brown. Look at the foam there. Look at that. Look I know. That. I saw that instantly too, you and I was like, oh, I don't even want to sip this. <laughs> It looks so thick. This oh, is yeah, a it's thick very, juice. Look at that. Yeah, 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 yeah. It's like dick juice? Is that what you said? Uh, thick juice, but yeah, <laughs> thick dick juice. So guys, here's, dick the, juice. here's the the one thing I will give Sleeman, although this doesn't make sense. All three of these beers are, have the same, like there's a unifying look to them, except for clear. Oh, that's the one that I fucking shotgunned. Except clear nice. 2.0. Do you know what I mean? So Yeah, it feels like that. Uh, Hang well, on. I think this is one of their popular beers. Hang on, I got a lot of beer on my keyboard. I gotta fix that real quick before it breaks something. Hopefully, it doesn't do anything. Hopefully, okay, it, it, s- is, are we are still we live? This, Hello, or? good, great. I like the uh, the uh, the color. The yeah, color is the we've same as the chart work before. What are you talking the about? The gold goes like well that? with the cream. The cream color or the white back. What is that? Is that eggshell white? Yeah, it's Off an eggshell white. white color. Yeah, if you're looking at if you're looking at painting a bedroom, it's eggshell white for sure. Oh, <laughs> it's that clear 2.0. This is not going well with the uh, hot pepperoni either. Yeah, I don't know why you did that to yourself. That, that was a big mistake. Guys, I don't know why you like this. You know what this tastes like? Brandy. This tastes like carbonated brandy. This sucks. No, it doesn't. This beer sucks. I'll. I don't I'll, think it I will, sucks. I till the day I fucking die. I'm gonna tell you right now, it doesn't taste good in a can. I like it better in the bottle. No, I'm telling I you, like I like it better I think, on tap. You guys, no, you guys oh, are coming. Tap, you guys are coming around to my way of thinking. This beer blows. No, it's, it's not blowy. It's not quite blowy. It doesn't but blow. It's, you know, it's not great. There's better honey lagers for sure. No, it tastes like a, it tastes like oh, maybe honey no. nut Cheerios that w- went through like a nuclear holocaust, and then I found a box no, you actually and like they were the irradiated. Honey lager I like my favorite honey lager graded on tap too is Whistler Bear Paw honey oh, lager. Are we oh. are we reviewing that one or are we reviewing Sleeman Honey Brown right now? Well, I'm saying that it's a good fucking honey lager. Okay, yeah, and this so is, is this one a good honey lager? If it is, great. If not, why not? It's okay. It's it's okay. It's a little. Um, no, I I, I still like this one too. It's a little sweet. This tastes like the Charmaine bear took a shit in a can. I hate that. Right, this doesn't taste like shit at all. This it would tastes, not be shit unless it's, shit. It tastes it sweet. This tastes terrible. This tastes like Winnie the Pooh did a line like 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 this like, like, like Winnie the Pooh turned to a, a life of crime did a line of cocaine. And then was like, like uh, he was like a super villain, and he developed some kind of weird honey that when you fling There's, it on people, you, they turn it, they, they get they get brainwashed, and they turn it. That into sounds like head. a great like Disney Plus exclusive for adults, like the people who grew up with Winnie the Pooh. You watch him be a villain. <laughs> yeah, okay. great. Yeah, Disney's really gonna go for that one. Hey, I got a pitch it's, for you guys. What's your pitch? Hey, Winnie the Pooh turns honey. to a it's life of crime honey. and drugs. Very honey. <laughs> yeah, fuck yeah. Yeah, make yeah. it really like gritty. And yeah. Dark. Okay. Yeah. And then Piglet's his little like second in command. Yeah. And then like, but uh, so like Winnie the Pooh keeps his hands clean, so to speak, except for the honey. But then Piglet is the one that really fucks people up. Do you know what I mean? It's like, how much Ooh, do you owe? Yeah. 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 Oh, that's boy. enough. Oh, and Eeyore, Eeyore is oh. the good guy, I guess. A pig, or, or Eeyore's running like an underground like like resistance, right? So then, yeah. then yeah. So then <laughs> Pooh's like, oh bother, find Eeyore. Rip his tail off and strangle him with it. And then Ooh, and I can't. I don't. I don't know what Piglet sounds like. But then Piglet's like, yeah. Piglet gets like the like bloodlust in his eyes, and then he rips that fucking tail off Eeyore, and he's just strangling with it. He's got Whoa. maybe a tiny little pig Piglet boner. Okay, this is fucked. What pig boner? Pig that. dicks. Uh, pig dicks look like corkscrews. Ah, oh, damn it. I don't yeah. even know. That took a hard uh, left turn. Uh, anyways. Pig dicks are insane. They like look like a corkscrew, like a like a, a, a wine bottle opener. Yeah, yeah, I know. I think cats' dicks look the same too. That's crazy. Oh, you would know, wouldn't you? Uh, I would. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, one bit of your ass. <laughs> yeah. 
God damn it. <laughs> well, I, yeah. Hi, everyone. Welcome to Beer Me. Yeah, Honey Brown's not that great. Welcome to Bestiality Me. That's your OnlyFans show. $10, uh, $10 a subscription. Honestly, can you guys tell me why you like this beer so much? Adam Snow said meow. It's I think it's it's a warm tasting, you know. Yeah, it's, 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 a, yeah. it's a it's a fun flavor. Gives you like a campfire vibes or Yeah, you're in a log uh, cabin summertime you're wearing yeah. you're, wearing a, you're wearing a wool jacket in the summer. This is a good summertime <laughs> beer. You, you it's nighttime. You think... it's, it's 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 10. Yeah, no, I will that... agree though. It's, I don't know if this is a summer beer, but I do like it. Why do you like it? It sucks. It sucks. Oh, it's got flavor. It's, like it's the first beer that we've all it's actually got time. flavor. Yeah, but I don't like. I don't. I'm not looking for a lot of flavor in my medicine. Do you know what I mean? I'm not like. I want. I want there to be a hint of something. <laughs> well, then, that's what I call my medicine. Don't drink honey <laughs> like, I, you, uh, I'm not looking for a lot of flavor in my medicine. Well, now you're the bias. That's yeah, a bias. That you're like biased. You see, uh, what do you, you mean I'm biased? I know what I like. I know what I don't like. I don't like this. Well, that's fair, man. Whatever. You're right. It is better yeah. in a bottle, but still, this is this is trash. You've oh, had a lot of honey. Have you had a few honey browns before? They don't make a lot of honey browns, actually. A beer ahead of its time. I mean, it must be because it, it doesn't do well in this time. Brew well, with natural honey, a beer that has always stood out for its smooth, distinctive flavor and rich copper color. It sucks. It does have a copper color. I'll give it that. In the bottle, yeah. it it yeah, glistens. I'll give it that too. If we're grading the color, I'll give it ten out of ten. It's copper, like they said. What are you talking about? I don't think I, I like your tone. I don't give a shit. Five point two percent. I will give them that though. A bit of an extra little bump up. I like yeah, that. Yeah, they I give you a little taint. A little, yeah, little got, bit extra. Your medicine is a little little higher percentage. You know what? That's very uncouth of you to call it medicine and kind of disrespectful. So you just yeah. fucking said that. Oh, okay. Yeah. Well, I can say it, but you can't. Oh wow. I'm gonna go with that. You know what this looks like, or this tastes like? This tastes like Shay's shirt in a liquid form. Uh, yeah. I mean, that's not a bad thing. It, that's it, the color. Sweat and all. I don't know why you guys like this. I'm getting like a little bit. I swear to God, like Honey Nut Cheerios that have gone off. Like you know when you have cereal with the box open for a long time and then it gets stale. Yeah. It's kind of like stale Honey Nut Cheerios. What? I like, do taste honey nut Cheerios, like, but they they're nice. Get, they're not nice and crunchy. They're kind of gummy. Whoa, I don't. About, are you talking uh, about an uh, uh, old load in a sock? Nope. Yeah, my nope. parents cared about me, so we always had fresh Cheerios. Oh, they, yeah. Oh, oh, wow. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I never. Uh, Cheerios were. Cheer, Cheerios are actually underrated. Yeah, dude, they're pretty fucking good. I swear Cheerios that. are underrated. They're, they're the most ubiquitous snack slash breakfast cereal alive they're underrated no, I'm, about, I'm not talking about honey nut. <laughs> I'm talking about regular stuff. cheerios okay whatever honey nut the or regular like just the, the ones that have the heart would, on it okay i would yeah. argue honey nut cheerios are more popular than regular cheerios you know what i used to like when i was they a are. kid even though no one uh, raisin bran oh yeah two scoops of raisin in kellogg's raisin bran yeah, I but I, I liked it when I was a kid. I thought Raisin Bran was Do you know why you liked it when a kid? Check the sugar content on that. It was fucking gobs of it. It was like a can of Coke per bowl. What the fuck are you talking about? There was so much sugar in Raisin Bran. <laughs> well, I think the, 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 the pieces of Raisin have sugar on them. Everything had sugar in it. No, the yeah, brand I, itself I, doesn't have sugar. You, you uh, got the wrong fucking cereal, buddy. Right. <laughs> I think I know what Raisin Bran is. Why don't you check the sugar content, okay? You, you like sugar? A... Like fucking Cinnamon Toast Crunch? You liked it as a kid because it was jam packed with that sugary yeah. load from no, that. No, I like the raisin and the brand. And I could Why have a healthy shit while I was eating the times. No fucking kid likes the taste of raisin bran without all of the sugar they put in there. What sugar? I don't even remember the sugar. That's the genius of it. You think it's <laughs> yeah, healthy. It's, it's not. Raisin bran is for adults. At least at least at least Fruit Loops were being honest with themselves. Like there was nothing. There. Yeah, they were. Yeah, that was yeah. my job. Raisin Bran. You're out of your fucking mind no, right no, now. The Raisin no, no, Bran no, no, is a no. healthy option for adults. <laughs> what? Kids. No, 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 no. You no, had no, it no. as a kid. Cereal. Raisin Bran is not a kid cereal. Oh my! But you God. had it as a kid. It you know is the a kid greatest cereal. trick the devil ever pulled was convincing the world he didn't exist. I had it as a cereal because my much like Raisin Bran, convincing you that it's a healthy breakfast alternative. It is well, not. It's not cinnamon toast crunch. 
you might cinnamon toast crunch is more honest they're like you know what guys this is garbage but you're gonna like how it Why tastes they make a brand yeah. cereal for children that's a it's not a brand cereal for kids they're not making it for kids they're making it for anyone who thinks they want a healthy alternative to a quick five dollar box of breakfast <laughs> no that's per brand it's so you can stay regular what it's not the last thing raisin brand is gonna do is keep you regular it's gonna clog you up you're so much your foot's mind. gonna that fall cereal off is made for people that need to take a dump no, okay. Well, they're gonna need fucking insulin what? pretty quick if they Raisin keep eating brand? it. Yeah, it's bran. No one gets a bran cereal for the taste. I'm saying raisin bran was tasty. Exactly. No one gets. Hey, board meeting right now. All right, we need a we need a healthier alternative at least on paper. Uh, well, bran. Are you fucking stupid, Kyle? No one's gonna no one's gonna fucking buy bran cereal. Oh, what if we load it with sugar? All right, you're onto something. And we we have a we have a um a guarantee on the box. Like what? Like two scoops, two scoops in every box, two scoops, There's, lots it's of not sugar. Sweet Fuck at yeah, all. I let's don't do it. Kyle, hey, if you want me to take a dump in a box and mark a guarantee, I will. I'm telling you right now. Look uh. up how much sugar. Next time you go to the store, I don't even know when that'll be. Next time you Amazon Prime some fucking cereal to your house, look at how much sugar is in Raisin Bran, and then get I some fruit loops. You should. Prime. Yeah. <laughs> You house, should. Okay? You should. Corn That's a pro says sugar. It's crazy. You can't Amazon Prime milk, but you can Amazon Prime raisin bran. Get that. Frosted shit done. flakes are actually pretty good too. I haven't had those in a while. I even frosted like the one they get soggy. Frosted, frosted flakes, flakes are you know only they good when they're, they're crisp. No, 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 no. When frosted flakes, the second they become soggy, it's fucking canned dog food. No, I just oh, I love it. I love it. I, I love, love it soggy. I did. It's the only cereal where if it goes soggy, it's no. good. Yeah, no, it's what true. the? F I am so vehemently against soggy frosted flakes that I'm what? angry at you both right now. Soggy frosted. Uh, flakes. Yeah, that's crazy. It's, like it's good. good wet cat. leaves. I would rather eat my cat's vomit than soggy frosted flakes. They're disgusting. Bullshit. No, I that's swear to God. Out of your it's fucking sugary. mind. It's sugary Frosted goodness. Are the mouth. best when they get soft. No, it's the, they're the worst. You need that crispness with the frosted you flakes. You need both. You need to be both. In the I'm beginning, going to it's my in-laws next week, and they usually have frosted flakes, and I have it when every time I go there, and I know. Tony the, the tiger. Becomes, oh, they're great when they're crispy, not when they're soggy. No, they're good. They're good both. Right. That's what's We're beautiful so, about them. Yeah, Liam said stiff flakes fuck jake said welcome to cereal me that's a great point that's yeah sorry uh, oh yeah uh, honey kieran brown. said i'm with trev but here's how bad sleem and honey brown is you don't want to talk about anything but like you don't talk about you don't want anything else but this well thank you kieran you're 100 really right decent. it's liam says decent. raisin bran is my healthy option that wasn't props to trevor for the devil's usual subjects reference thank you so much uh raisin bran is for seniors who need to poop no jason it's not gonna help you poop it's not. It, it's brain. Robin said, "P.S. Toronto just lost." I know. Oh, poor you. Adam said, "Has an old tavern on the east coast on a rainy day feel." This is the beer, not the cereal. Didn't make the catch quota, and now it's looking more and more like you're gonna. You aren't going to be able to afford that John boat your neighbor's sailing. What's a John boat? What John? Rusty said, "I agree with you, Rusty." Although I don't think I can repeat that. <laughs> Rusty said the devil's ejaculate is the consistency of soggy frosted flakes. Yeah. Uh, no no way. I, I, well, it I, makes I just, sense why it tastes so good. To you. Yeah. I, I, that's insane. Frosted flakes is the only cereal where it's good. No. Gomi looked it up. Raisin bran sugar, 18 grams. Fruit Loops sugar, 12 grams. There's what? less sugar in Fruit Loops. That's when I was crazy. eating Fruit Loops like an asshole, I was actually it was less. Oh, it was wow. healthier. It's healthier to eat Fruit Loops. Fruit Loops are great. That's it. Yeah, Decided, Gomi. Thank you. Thank you. Thank Gomi. you for proving my point. My Hell yeah! Now back to this beer. We're way over for time. Well, um, what would you brown... what would you rate Frosted Flakes out of ten? Well, if they're crispy or soggy, what are you talking about? Yeah, what both crispy? I would rate crispy like. Nine out of ten, soggy. Eight out of ten. Honestly, this beer is like carbonated, soggy frosted flakes. Wow! Well, it, it, no, it's not. It sucks. Well, it makes sense because Dave and I like this, and we also <laughs> like soggy frosted flakes. So. Liam says Fruit Loops are spelled wrong. Look at the box. No, I know they're they're doing a play on the loops. Liam. Yeah. I love soggy frosted flakes. I have to tell you, it's right. I, I've no never one, talked okay. with anybody too. No one cares yeah, anymore. Me too. Soggy flakes. You know, at one point in time. <laughs> A few years ago, I said that this tastes like a homeless man pissed in my open mouth. <laughs> yeah, I know. And I stand by that statement. What? No this way. This beer fucking sucks. 
Not nearly as bad as Bud Nitro. Don't get me wrong. But also <laughs> being in a summer select, like a summer selections pack. Again, not a summer beer. This oh. in the IPA. What are you fucking thinking? No one's going out in a hot agree, day at yeah. noon to a beach and cracking open a honey brown lager unless they're a fucking psychopath that is wearing jeans and a long sleeve shirt and a bucket hat with sunglasses. They have a notepad out. And they're taking. They're they're tracking every single person that like, t- leaves Zitzy? leaves their group for how long and when so that they can hunt them down. <laughs> She's gonna kill someone. Put them in their Prius. Drive them That's back the, to the little basement suite and bomb. gut them. What? You're talking about Ted Kaczynski, the Yuma bomber. The only thing everyone any saw of him, it was him wearing that exact outfit. Wait, wait, who? What? The Yuma bomber, Ted Kaczynski. I don't know who that is. Yeah. You, what? I bet he, he liked. People, I bet he, he liked honey brown lager. Mail with bombs in it. He sent people mail with bombs in it. Oh, yeah. that guy. Well, I bet you that he did it while he was drinking honey brown lager. I'll tell you that much. Possibly. So should we rate honey brown lager? Adam says or... honey brown after taste, grandpa's no, look, wartime look, look, liquor. Look at his sketch. You just described Ted Kaczynski drinking a honey brown. Okay, well, where's the bucket hat? <laughs> well, no, I mean, hood like... on the hoodie, bucket hat, same kind of deal. There's something yeah, looks... on his brow. Oh. Yeah, you're right. I did. Ted Kaczynski. Wow. Uh, sleep in it. That was his sketch. Uh, uh, look, someone, you can buy Ted Kaczynski art. <laughs> <laughs> That's hilarious. I can't believe, and I, I, I truly can't believe that our species came through a pandemic. I mean, we're <laughs> almost there, and it's just like, this really should have leveled us. Like, nature's trying to tell us something. Fucking hell. Uh, Adam says, honey brown aftertaste equals grandpa's wartime liquor with a dash of stale dart taste. Oh, stale cigarettes? Oh, yeah. Or hard candy, or their favorite hard candy. Or you, you got bridge mixture. Oh, my God. Was it called Bridge, bridge of Spies? Mixture. Bridge of Spies? Is that the Tom Hanks movie with Spielberg? Yeah. Yeah, I I went there. I, I watched the movie with my wife. I went to the theater. I'm not even kidding you. In the in the fucking beginning of the movie, there's a lady opening up Werther's toffees and then putting her all the. She's like, "Is that Alan Alda? I love him." Oh, <laughs> You're lying. Oh I swear to God. Ask my wife. I swear to God. I wasn't even like she was so loud. But I was in the theater and I looked at her. I was like, I can't even be mad because this is so on point. Like. Yeah, it's perfect. Like, it's what so movie did we watch recently where Alan Alda turned out to be the bad guy? What was that? Alan Spoilers. Alda turned out to be the bad guy? I don't know. Seasons four of MASH and on? Oh, no, no. no uh, Geostorm. No fucking... Alan Alda was not in Geostorm. Yeah, oh, was he? It was one of those disaster films where you you find out that the bad guy was the... the, 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 like the oh, man Jake... Tour. No, no. Jake nailed it. And Dave, we didn't watch it. I guarantee this came on Netflix and you rewatched it. Tower yeah, which... Heist. Yes! <laughs> Thank you, Jake. Jake one. nailed it. Jake said Tower Heist. Yeah, there it is. Yeah. I saw that on Netflix. It's so funny. I saw it on Netflix. I was like, I should watch that again. Oh, it was a great... It came out at Thanksgiving. It was a great, like, uh, Christmas movie. Like, uh, that time of year to watch that movie. Yeah, with huh. Ben Stiller? Never oh, seen that. Oh, God. This is horrendous. Okay, I'm rating Honey Brown Lager first. Oh, no. Here's the thing. I actually dislike Pure Point more. Oh. At least Honey Brown has a smoother finish to it, but I'm not drinking it on a summer day. In the fall, I'll drink it if I have to. The 5.2% is kind of nice, but it's definitely a break in case of emergency beer for me. I have it floating around in my fridge. <laughs> if I have to drink it, I will, but other than that, I'm pawning it off on some unsuspecting guests, especially YouTube <laughs> fucks because nice. you like it. So I'm going to give it... I'm going to give it a 3 out of 10. Wow. 3 out of 10? You fucking piece of shit. Are you kidding me right now? I'm being generous. I was going to give it a 2, and I went up to 3. You're fucking welcome. How dare um, you? It's, it's no, Shay, what are you doing? Yeah, I mean, I, I definitely think there's better better honey lockers out there, but it's uh, still, you know, it's not the most satisfying. I'm going to give this a nice, hard <laughs> 6 a hard out of 10. Soft. 6 out of 10, you're fucking insane. Um, Dave was yeah, hoping I'm for right a bit more support, Shea. I love it. Uh, if it's cold and it's in the bottle and, it, and it's the right atmosphere, it's okay. It's so there's bad. a lot yeah, of there's a lot of it. things that predicate your enjoyment of it. That's the sign of a great beer. Exactly. That's why it's the yeah. six. Isn't that why you drink certain beers, you fucking troll doll? <laughs> if it's predicated on having to hit certain benchmarks, That's chances are it's not a great beer. beer at the beer store. That means there's some there's something good in it, but it's not great. You know, six mm-hmm. out of ten. 
No, yeah, yeah, Dave, get on that mic. By the way, swallow it whole for me. Hey, Dave, you know, go comatose for me. very loud, right? Yeah. No, he, yeah, he, he'll know when Skype cut, cuts him off again. Fix you. Okay, I hope it cuts you off sooner rather than later. Um, uh, yeah, um, I like Joseph said, any plans on filming together after the break? Pretty sure it's allowed now. I miss the in-person beer me. Joseph, love you. We miss it too. We have a lot of stuff planned. I hope you stick with him. Robin said you fucking trolled all ha 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 ha. Okay. That's mean. First I don't even all, know why I said trolled all. I didn't even reflect anything about you. I just said it because I it was the first thing that came to my mind. The first thing that came to your mind. I'm surprised anything came to your mind, you vacant little fuck. Um, <laughs> That's wow. true. But we uh, we have lots of stuff planned, Joseph. And I hope you stick with us because we got some fun things uh, coming up soon. Uh, all right, that brings us to Speed River Pilsner, which I kind of love the name of. Hey, can oh, I get River a Speed Pilsner. River Pilsner from the freezer, please? Thank oh, you. I gotta get mine. Yeah, uh, yeah, you guys. Yeah, do your Speed thing. River Pilsner, Pilsner. Thank you so much, my wife. Okay. My wife Saskia. Yeah. Robin, come <laughs> on, man. Come on, you fucking. You can hear me. Thank you. Just double checking. Just double checking. All right, so, Speed um, River Pilsner. Hell yeah. Thank you so much, Speed River. Kieran says, Honey Brown Sleemans was, is what one of my clients always offers me when I do his lawn. Yeah, do you want to know why, Kieran? He doesn't like it. Oh, yeah, that's exactly what it is. Because he's a connoisseur. He's giving it away. Adam said, dude, I love Alan Alda. Who doesn't? If you don't like Alan Alda, you're a dick. Liam said, a live trudging along would be... Yeah, chaos. Yeah, Liam, a live trudging along would not work at all. It just, we couldn't do it. We'd have to... I, uh, I mean, it might a, work a if it was like a live live show with an audience, but like live streaming wouldn't work. Holy Rusty shit! What? The Speed what? River logo is two guys about to die in a waterfall. <laughs> it looks like they're tragically, uh, like frantically trying to get out of the current. Oh yeah, that's a Rusty current. said. I like a brown lager with some saucy ribs off the smoker. Okay, Rusty. Yes, this beer, like a shitty cooking wine, would be great for making something like ribs. You nailed it, my guy. Well, you could mix that, but that's like molasses. You're talking about molasses. Uh, yeah, I guess, yeah. Uh, Rusty said, I like a brown lager with some sauce. Oh, wait, I already said that already. Jason that's said, that's... honey brownest and Ted Bundy instincts. Forget the other Ted. Yeah, hell yeah. Look, this beer looks like two guys have been caught in the current, and they're desperately trying to get out of it, or yeah, they're going to Yeah, 100%. Like they, were, like, they were going fishing, and then they didn't realize it led to the mouth of a waterfall. Yeah. Yeah, I love or, that. Or or a raging river. Like yeah. it, now the there's like rapids. You're 100 percent right. Can you guys see that? Are these named after af actual places in Canada? Speed River and Pier Point and shit oh, like that. Let's hey. let's look it up. Speed River. I'll read what it says in the can. As crisp as the currents, like the cold cascading waters that carry the corpses of the unfortunate souls over them, this easy drinking <laughs> pilsner. Made from three distinct. It is hops. a real river. It's in. It's in. Um. It's in. Uh. Ontario. Kitch it goes through Kitchener, Ontario. So okay. Pier Point is definitely a real place. Oh, 100 percent, it's a real place. Again, with corpses. That means Clear Point. Clear 2.0 might be a real place too. So that's, that's not cool. a real place. Don't be an idiot. Come on. Like the cold, oh, cascading waters of the Speed River. Yeah, Speed River's um, um, uh, capitalized. So it's definitely a real place. This easy drinking pilsner made from three distinct hops is as crisp as is refreshing. Okay, so again, this is a shit mix beer. I haven't even cracked it yet, but my hopes are not high. What? It's three different hops. Why is do they the, always fucking do this? Is yeah, this I feel the like they're trying to make that sound good, but uh, is this the exclusive one? If this is the exclusive one, then they made it. They knew it was shit and they packaged it. Now they're this they want is to sell the exclusive. They this, want is the, for a, this is the exclusive one. I bet it also, like for shit. a Pilsner to be under 5%, that's a little iffy. Yeah, 4.8? What is that? Is it bad, Dave? No, it's actually okay. That's not wow, bad. this is great. This is pretty yeah, good. That's, that's, oh, that's, my yeah, God. Bad. I thought it's for not, sure. It's like the first one I'm actually... Thoroughly wow. enjoying. Wow, it's like it's like if you're a dad and you and you you hear you hear your wife's gonna give birth to it, triplets and you're like this is gonna be a nightmare. Then it comes tastes, out and they're great. It actually tastes like the yeah. clear 2.0, but a beer. It yes yes, it tastes like clear 2.0 with slightly more alcohol, with less rainwater and so yeah. Straight. Oh, this is great. This is great on the palate. Oh my god, it tastes like I'm about to hit this waterfall with these guys, and I this is I don't even care. No trouble. Glad, yeah, shout out to this. 
Shout out you to this care, order, you're, though. Nothingness? Shout out to what? The order, because I'm so glad that this is now after the, sh- after the IPA and the Honey Brown. Because yeah, four point eight percent. It's a little lower than I'd want, but this this tastes I, it's like just, it's okay. That's it's not okay. bad. It's not, I mean, but hang on a sec. Let's go for this taste. What's it taste like? Yeah, this tastes like I'm headed for disaster, and I'm cool as a cucumber. This tastes like I work well under pressure. It, no, it tastes like yeah. it tastes like you went out on a fishing trip and you didn't realize that you were gonna drink on it, and then your boss comes and he pulls open the cooler and it's filled with beer. Yeah, 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 like, yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, like you're, you're not yeah. like you're going out with, or like maybe your 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 brother invites you to like an yeah, investment meeting with a potential investor. Fairly, you don't know if they're drinkers or not, or or they like to have yeah, fun. Yeah, yeah, like your brother pitched you this idea, and then you're like, okay, well, we got yeah. some potential yeah, investors. They want us Make to come have pitch a beer them. With our sandwich, and yeah. then he, he opens up a cooler and it's fucking all beers and there's yes. no food. Yes, it's like no okay, food. we're gonna go, we're gonna go pitch these guys. They want to invite us in their boat, like they're loaded. You're like, okay, well, like you and you guys nailed down your pitch to a T. Like you've got your business plan, strategy, percentages, market share, market penetration. I just want to say penetration, script penetration. Work. And then yeah, you get there, and words. you get there, and the guy's like, "Right, guys. So, like, I think I like your business, but I don't know about you guys. Why don't you grab some beer, and then we'll just hang out?" And you open the cooler, like you said, Dave, fucking yeah. packed to the brim. Yeah, and you like, thought. Oh, wait, this guy just wants to fuck. Here. This yeah. guy just wants to hang out, drink beer, and see if we're chill. We got this. That's the taste of this beer. It's surprisingly good. It's su- yeah. it was a surprise. Lovely. Oh my God, Jose Luis Cibrian just subscribed. Thanks. Jose, thank you. Thanks, Jose. Welcome. Enjoy. Adam says, "Couple of these, and if I was one of the guys in that canoe, I would hop out and boogie board my way straight to paradise." Yeah, hell yeah. Yeah, yeah. Does yeah. that mean to your death? It really is a. It, I mean, it's a, so. it's fun. You find out, the, yeah, somebody you didn't know turns out to be okay. It's, it's cool gonna be okay. Daryl yeah. said, "I don't like honey brown, but that was my favorite of the four. Daryl, what is wrong with you? What what Daryl say? Daryl said I don't like honey brown, but it was his favorite of the four. You didn't like anything else about the honey brown? I thought Daryl had to fuck off for his sister's birthday. No 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 no. That was D L. <laughs> oh D L. Oh, oh D L had to leave. Uh, I heard Daryl. Yeah. Daryl's been here the whole time, and I mean Daryl, I don't know how to say this, but you're dead wrong. You're dead wrong, dude. I still <laughs> think this is it. like this I, I still am not blown away by anything so far. I have to admit. What? I'm right? blown away by the 2.0 at 80 calories and 4%. That beer wait, fucks. Wait, the Speed River's blowing my skirt right up, right over my head. Yeah. It's, it's, not, I can't, okay. This is a beer they should definitely sell in 12 packs. I would fuck with this all day long. And this is a versatile beer in that you could have it in the summer, fall, winter. You're right. Maybe not. Yeah, they, they did a good job. The Speed River, uh, if they're testing. This should this be a new out, staple. Yeah, this should be in their, in their rotation. And where it's not, this isn't. This is the Jose Canseco of Sleeman beers. I don't think they have a Pilsner in their rotation. And I'm telling you right now, they got a home run right here. Is Jose yeah, Canseco a, fa- a baseball player? Mm-hmm. Wow. I somehow knew that and then said home I run. I only knew that because Jim Carrey references him in Liar Liar. The movie. Yeah, Jose Canseco? Yep. How was that for you? I've had better. Yep. That's the best part. That's, the best yeah, part right after that. that. When he's thinking about how how he said that in the mirror to himself while he's brushing yeah. his teeth. I've had better. <laughs> I've had better. Yeah. And he's laughing to himself. It's great. Yeah. So nice. good. Um, yeah, no, this 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 Speed River Pilsner, it, 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 it tastes nice and crisp, <laughs> like clean water. Like the water upstream before you piss in it. Oh, yes, yeah. Not shitty rainwater. Like yeah, the nice, cold, crisp, flowing, pre-piss. It's delicious. I love it. Pre-piss yeah. water is the best water. Yeah, I, we don't have that enough, but pre-piss water is the best. I feel like I'm being mocked right now. Also, West Coast is the <laughs> best coast. Okay, now you're just rhyming shit. Yeah, uh, West Coast. No, my my good my good friend in high school. I told did I tell you story? His his binder in high school on the front in thick black uh, felt said West Coast is the best coast. <laughs> Who from the East Coast for him. him? Was it his ex-girlfriend? Huh? Yeah, I've never been Did to Did he have a long-distance relationship so. with someone that just didn't work out? I just said West Coast is the best coast. Yeah. So he's saying And that I'm asking it... you what prompted him to write that. Oh, I hear you. I didn't hear yeah, it. Why I, does I, he hate the West jumbled. Coast? 
Oh, or East Coast. No, I think I, he's just repping his. He's repping his set. Okay, so he didn't. He wasn't dating someone <laughs> who then left him to fly to the East Coast to then date someone else. Like the no. true love of his life didn't go. You know what? There's a guy in Newfoundland that I really no, want to no, go. There's I, a fishmonger out there. No, he can't. Someone just be proud where they're from. I mean, sure, but you think you have a reason? That, what do you mean? Pride. Well, like I, I'm, I'm from a, a city called Saint Albert, Alberta. Why am I proud of it? There's a cool bridge near Seven Eleven that you can sit under and drink beers. Oh, that's kind of cool. That's nice. That's delightful. Yeah, nice. that's the best. Uh, all I can visualize I of your of hometown is an intersection. That's all I see. An intersection uh, and flat land. Okay. It's not Saskatchewan, you ignorant slut. And you've been there. Yeah, but that's... I brought no, you there I'm, one time. Last time. I know, and way, I appreciate that. My, my hometown bullshit. had a park in it. A nice big park that you can go <laughs> yeah, and yeah, drink. You're no longer allowed 200 yards from? Yeah, I was banned from there from years ago. Years all ago. parks, I would assume, based on the, 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 court, um, the, court, the court ruling, but... Jesus... Yeah, no, I think it's a uh, pretty good pilsner. Yes, exactly. You guys, you guys know this better than I do. Does it taste like a pilsner? It just tastes like kind of like a yeah, nice, easy going yeah. lager to me. This actually tastes yeah, this like what it's trying to be. Yeah. These this beers are big. nailing me, by the way. I'm just feeling great. Yeah, I actually feel very much in the zone right I now. Yeah, I'm right in the pocket. I'm right in the pocket. Yeah, which is a good indication of this pack overall because... Yeah, that's good reliability. I don't like two of them. I really enjoy the other two, but I am feeling good. So, a couple more, and I can get past the fact that I hate two of them. Yeah, it's kind of like enough. your girlfriend's friends. I like two of them. I hate the other two. But if we hang out a few more with the two that I like... I can get past the fact that I hate those other Oh, things. yeah, that's fair, yeah. Do you know what I mean? Mm-hmm. I Shay, hear that, you were man. Pretty, Shay, you were, you were pretty um, quick to agree with that. How does your wife feel about that? No, 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 not about my current situation. Oh, okay, because no, if you were like, oh, no, I understand completely what you no, mean. No, no, no. But, Just that, you know, in the past, sometimes that's happened. Oh, like, so, like, a couple of years ago when you guys were dating or? No, nothing to do with his current relationship. God oh, damn it. I love okay, all it just seems like it. I'm, I'm, okay, whatever. I'm just... <laughs> Rusty said, I'm from Pittsburgh. Only Venice, Italy has more bridges to drink under than we do. <laughs> Hell yeah. Is that real? Is that real, I don't know, Rusty? but it sounds great. Did you say Venice? Jason says, I grew up in Surrey. My, home's home, my hometown had murderers. Liam said, oh, St. Albert is the hot spot yeah, for my that buds. Is, that's I, good old oh, Surrey. Adam said, Seven Hills is lit. That's from, that's from St. Albert, too. Yeah, seven, there's this... There's this great tobogganing site called Seven Hills. Uh, oh, Adam cool. Adam Snow said, "I'm from Newfoundland." LOL. Hell yeah. So he so so he doesn't agree with your buddy's binder. Yeah. Yeah. Well, uh, you know what, Adam Snow, suck it. Uh, uh, Robin said, "You guys done Ho Garden? We have done Ho Garden. It was pretty oh, good. Oh, great beer. Yeah. Um, Adam Adam L said, "Speed River is the official sponsor of getting pinned on the golf course." This would be a great golf course beer. Great golf beer. It's great. Everything. It's very versatile. Versatile. Yeah. A lot of situations. This is their one it's summer beer in the beer. summer yeah. pack. Yeah. Or, you know what? I really like their cream ale. Cream ale is like great. Cream ale is Oh, okay. Let's rate the this. And then while we're rating it, I need you guys in the chat to let us know what beer you want us to do for downability. Oh God! They both Maybe we shouldn't have given thing. them that choice. No, we should. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and rate Speed River Pilsner first. Uh, I love the artwork. I love the description. The coloring's great. Taste is yeah. good. Um, her. I'm. I would give it a nine, but I've only had one. I'm mean, an eight out of ten. Wow. Cold yeah, it's my favorite dude. one. It's my favorite one that I've had. Eight out of ten for this guy. Um, uh, Shay, you, I'm I'm going with nine. I think it's a triumph. Nine Whoa. out of ten. Yeah, it's a. If this is their new beer, they're trying to fucking ease into the uh, the rotation by putting it in a summer pack. Then they've succeeded. That's a great point. I would definitely buy a twelve pack of this. Yeah, I think it would be even better out of a bottle. Yeah, oh, it don't make bottles. If it makes the if it makes the cut. Yeah, if it makes the cut and they make some bottles, I'm a fan for life. This is a good one. I'll just blow the glass for the bottles. Oh yeah, you'll hand blow it. Uh, oh Shay, yeah. Shay, what are you giving it? 
Or it'll taste great out of the brewmaster himself, you know? What the fuck? His flavor. Is what do you I'm going to give this a 8 out of 10. Yeah, I think it's definitely the best one. Oh, you're not going for 9? Fuck you both. Yeah, no. you know, you know no, I'm wrong not, with my quite, rating if Shay like and I really are on the same page. Me. I think it's there. I can't not give so, it a 9 if I think it should be part of the team. If it's going to join the team, how could I not give it a 9 out of 10? How come, come my 8 out of 10 join that you drew team. looks like a fucking fetus? Like, it looks like a fetus in an ultrasound photo. That's the afterbirth. That's the afterbirth. That's the that's placenta. What that's uh, Zach says, Speed River reminds me of the days me and Kieran Gorman would wait around outside dispensaries asking people to buy us weed in high school. That's a great life, Zach. Good for you. Is Zach from Ontario? I don't know. Uh, so I asked uh, everyone what we should do for downability. And um, the majority? The majority. Oh, God. It's the IPA. It's it's the pure. Of course it is. Yeah. Of course, like yeah. It's so obviously, look at our ratings. What yeah. else are they gonna choose? Ask someone, should I should I drink a glass of piss or yeah. a glass of milk? What are they gonna say? Piss milk. Yeah. They're gonna go. What's mix more the entertaining? Two. Yeah. Ah, oh, fuck you guys. That's upsetting. We didn't think that through. We rated um, it so much lower than the other ones too. Fuck. Panama Red says, "What is Dave's tat on his neck?" Dave, you want to show off your neck tat? Oh, what? You can see it? Uh, yes, can you turn it more? Can you swivel your body? There it is. What's it say? It says, I'm cool. I'm cool. Oh, hell yeah. Rusty says, we have 446 bridges here. According to Google, we now have three more than Venice, Italy. We took the lead, and I didn't even know it. Oh, my God. We well, can you, I this? guess. Okay, this is downability. And, what? Oh. What? Yeah. Okay. I gotta mentally prepare myself. Oh, so shit. based on your so guys' is, um, Jason says we want vomit with four exclamation marks. What the? Oh fuck no, shit? Jason! Uh, no, Jason! Why do you yeah, want is, that? You said not that kind of individual. It's not that kind of show. Well, it's like why people slow down when there's a car accident. Yeah, hundred percent. They want to see limbs. I'm actually like I'm fairly inebriated here. Really? Yeah, I'm thinking that this is going to really just put me over the edge. Hmm. Okay, good stuff. <laughs> uh, pure point you thought about it as if you're like a po- At 5.5%, so that's good. Oh, fuck. Okay, let's get through this. Um, I have uh, nothing to... Bitter batter. Shit. There's an empty... There's a, there's a McDonald's cheeseburger wrapper next to me. I could I could really fuck with a cheeseburger right now. That's how you know that I'm uh, feeling good. Jake said, "Okay, J- Jake, uh, the Pilsner might be delightful. You can do both if you want." No, I'm good. Thanks. Yeah, Gomi on Dave's neck is Caillou. Growing up is not so tough, except when I've had enough. But there's lots of fun stuff. I'm Caillou. Yeah, Daryl says, "Let's get at her, Dave. Let's get going, buddy." Nothing to it but to do it and all that some such bullshit. I'm having so much fun, except when I've had enough fucking little shit. A- is that Caillou? A- R- D- v- a- R- K. Zach says Caillou lore is crazy. What? What? I don't know. What's Caillou lore? Caillou's a piece of shit. He is a fucking loser. He's no a very kid. bad child. Like yeah. what? Like what the fuck? Your your kid. If if it if your kid's mad, then it gets what it wants. Like no, fuck no, off. No, no, no. It gets smacked around a bit and then sent to their room. That's uh well. I don't know if that helps. What either. would you do, Shay, if your child is misbehaving? Teach them a lesson. That's what I just Using said. Words. I just said how to teach. I just no. taught you how to teach them a lesson. No, you lock you lock them in a damp basement for four hours. That's not bad either. Oh, Jesus. No one's going to get mind. hurt for four hours, Shay. What's your problem? The basement is big. It's large. Yeah, There's they no have light. a lot of space to run around. Is the only light they see is the crack. The only light they see is the crack um, Under through the, door. the rest of the house. Yeah. So they can do like, they can still do shadow animals. Then. That's kind of fun. Yeah. 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 The, then, the only light is the crack to the kitchen. Yeah. And they okay, can smell. Dark. They um, can smell dinner cooking, but they're not allowed to eat for that meal. Jesus. <laughs> Just the meal. I mean, guys, what? They can't eat dinner. They were. They were bad. Well, I mean, uh, it depends on how bad they were. They broke okay. your laptop. Um, I'm gonna. I might pour my broke your laptop. They'd be in a fucking fucking tool shed. <laughs> They'd be in the Blindfold. cemetery. 
Yeah. They'd be in a tomb in a cemetery. Dead. Because you killed dead, them. Alive. <laughs> That's even worse. Shay, were you not disciplined as a child? It shows, by the way. Uh, not in that way. Not not in the mean oh, way. Oh, and Shay, I heard you say just like my brain's catching up that you're pouring it in the glass. No, you're shotgunning it. Get the fuck out of here. Really? Yeah. We've already done one though. That, that was, was the beer shotgun. barrel. That was the beer barrel. But it went terribly wrong, and yes, I spilled it on myself. Yeah. Oh, should I lock <laughs> you in a basement for four hours? I'm thinking about it. <laughs> God damn it. Liam said Caillou was banned in my house because he was such an ass. <laughs> That's yeah, great. Yeah, it was like for, it was like teaching kids to be fucking losers. Yeah, it was like it was definitely saying the wrong. Oh, Jake wants to know how much pepperoni this time, Dave. It's <laughs> a little bit nice. Jason says this is the first time I've seen you guys. You guys are awesome. Thanks, man. When are you guys back after the break? That's a great question. I didn't consult with my homies here. Um, Beer Me is going on a hiatus of at least two weeks. It might be longer. So we're figuring stuff out. Uh, it'll be back uh, within the next like three, four weeks. So we're figuring stuff out. Uh, we'll be back with some video game streams in two weeks. And then we'll I'll have more information for you guys then. We'll figure it out. But we're, we're not going anywhere. We're just taking a break. And then when we get back, we got some fun stuff planned that I think you guys are going to like. And Jason, this is the first time you're seeing us. We have lots of edited episodes that we did pre-pandemic that you can go back and, and watch. We're going to have, <clears throat> we're gonna have more of those very soon. Very soon. Uh, okay, so let's do down ability. Yeah, let's just do it. Pure point, because you guys are sadistic little pricks. Thank you so much. Oh. oh, my God. Even the smell is just... Oh, I dripped on my leg. I've heard that before. Okay. You know what? You wish. <laughs> yeah, that's exactly it, Western Canyon. Uh, no, I'm actually... I'm going... I'm going... I'm going home to see some family. That's why we're taking... That's why we're taking a break. And there's, there's some other stuff that... We have going on that that uh, might be mitigating in terms of us coming back when we want to, but I don't want to um, do this at all. I know me either. Uh, I, yeah, but I'm I'm going home to see some family, and that is why we're taking the break. And we usually take a break during the summer, so it just works well. Oh yeah, Carlos and Saul just subscribed. Thanks, buddy. Appreciate it. Thanks, Thank Carlos. Guys, Thank you. All right, nothing too about to do it. Hang on, I, I feel like there's a. I've been no! seeing a physio for the past couple months, and he adjusts my back when I go. I feel like I need oh, to have yeah. someone here to adjust my chest when I down too much beer so they get all of the foam out. Oh, yeah. That's great. This is going to send me right over the falls, by the way. Why am I seeing a physio? What? Yeah. I fucked up my back from like three weeks I was couch ridden because of COVID. Oh, shit. That sucks. Yeah. But it's good you got a physio, boy. Yeah, and it's all covered because of my uh, my wife's uh, work. It's great. Oh, nice. Yeah, I don't have to pay a cent. Well, I got to pay like 10 bucks when I go on him. Oh. Did you say when you go down on him? If Dave wasn't so upset about having to do this, he'd be making comments about hand release. You're counting how many beers you've done? Why are you doing that? Just thinking, man. Just thinking out loud. Thinking out loud. Okay, thinking take, out loud. Take it easy, Ed Sheeran. Robin, we could do a beer me with Caesars. We could do a vodka, like a hardened edition, and then make some Caesars. No, stop getting this out of your fucking mic. <laughs> Lights will guide you home. Oh, God, I can't wait. I'm going to drive home and huh? run off the cliff. Okay, you guys ready? Fix, yeah, that fix yeah, you. Fix you cold. Yeah, that's take a, fix you cold take play. a team of people working around the clock for at least a year to fix whatever's wrong with you, my guy. It wouldn't work. No, it wouldn't. That's the beauty of it. <laughs> they wouldn't figure it out. Okay, you guys ready? Uh, I should have just picked it a better beer and then not told you guys. But whatever. Okay, here we go. Ready? Yep. Mm -mm -mm. This is going to suck. Okay. Yeah, this is going to be the worst thing we've you done know what? in a while. Oh, usually the really shitty beers are, uh, turn out to be a fucking uh, rose. That's true. Why my, cause I like my whole is so far off, it's not even fucking funny. And I, I eyed it up and did everything I could. No, you didn't do everything you could. You this is so up. fucked. I can't even. It's so off. I can't open it. What the well, fuck? Well, you're gonna have to. You're gonna wrong? have to have some spill, boy. What the like fuck, I said, man? It takes a team. 
Okay. Actually, Dar- Daryl said you thought Clear 2.0 is going to be good, so who knows? Great point, Daryl. Let's go into this. That's true. Open. I was going to say that. Yeah, that's that's exactly right. Well, you didn't say Daryl said it. Yeah, I was trying to, and then Daryl beat me to it. No, oh, Daryl. Daryl knows where you live. He beat you. Yeah. Yeah. He beat you. Anyways, let's just do it. No more stalling. I've ever heard. All right. Yeah. Well, the timer's already up. Okay. Here we go. I don't care if it's already up. This is fucking IPA. We're downing an IPA. A 5.5% horrendous IPA. (sighs) Yeah. Just breathe. You guys ever wake up, look in the mirror, and think of all the wrong choices you've made in your life to, to, to arrive at that exact moment? Four or five times a day. I, four times. Five, four, four. That is not this day. Nice. Okay, here we go. Ready? Uh, yeah. Fuck. Okay, here we go. Three, two, one. Peer point. Yeah. Yeah. Whatever. No, if you're three, two, one. John Sleeman's dead. Is he really? I don't know, actually. <laughs> okay. Well, he probably is because this was he made probably... in the 1800s. <laughs> he probably is dead. Robin said John three, Sleeman. two, one, down on the clown. Down on the clown? John Sleeman's not alive anymore. There's no way. No way. This was made in the 1800s. Can yeah, we drink? They were they were around during Prohibition, which, by the way, fucking respect Sleeman. Still brewing beer during yeah. Prohibition. You have my vote. All right, let's go. So what yeah, are we saying? Please. Three, two, one, down on the clown? Three, two, one, <sighs> pre-cum. I'm not saying three, two, one, pre-cum. Fine, down on the clown since that folk. Precom is an amazing thing. It, no one think no, everyone sleeps on it. It's it's a very the last thing you want to do. By the way, is sleep on that. Okay, here we go. Three. Please. I think we do three, two, one. Down on the clown. Okay, let's do it, please. Okay. Blah. Okay, here we go. Three, two, one. Down on the down clown. on down the, the clown. clown. Oh. oh my god it's like a tree it's, it's like tree. cutting open a d-cell battery and drinking the inside <laughs> Don't stop it <laughs> what am uh, I doing? oh man it's like cutting open a Buzz Lightyear doll and then just drinking any kind of liquid that comes out. That fucking uh, sucked. Ooh. Gomi said pre-cum is an amazing thing is the quote of, quote of 2021. Oh, Shay's puking. Uh, Western Canadian viewer says downing a barrel aged Imperial Stout is asking for trouble by the end of it. I think I'm going to die. Did she actually go to puke? I think he did, yeah. Got in his head. He either got to his head or he went to get head. I don't know which. Wow. Oh, man. That was yeah, okay. fucked. Down ability for this one. Oh, I'd rather clear. Mm. Oh, I might have to puke, too. It's not, it's not working. It's All not... I get is pepperoni stick and tree bark. Yeah, honestly, though, that's your own fault, right? You 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 nod off a knob of pepperoni stick before chugging back three hundred and fifty five milliliters of God only knows what. Oh my God! Stop it. Yeah, sorry. I knew that description would really. Uh... Liam said I already puked. Daryl said honestly, super proud of Dave. West. I'm I'm holding back. I, you know when you you gotta puke so much, you're getting way more saliva than you should. Oh yeah 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 like it's the pre cum of the mouth. A pre- oh, okay. <laughs> yeah, yeah. That's what. Isn't that what it is? Oh, okay. <laughs> oh, okay. Oh, oh, oh. I, knew, I knew that would get him. Oh, I can't wait to do this in person again. Um. Okay. Well, and now here we are. Um, and here we are, guys. Oh yeah, we're uh, we're bummed to go on a break. I might as well take this opportunity to talk to you guys. We're bummed to go on a, a, a break, but I'm gone, and uh, we usually take a break sometime over the summer. The summer's gonna look a little. The schedule is gonna be a little more off than usual. We've we're trying. We're yeah, 
I don't want to say too much until we actually start doing it. But we're going to try a new schedule, so to speak. Um, there's not going to be as many live streams over the summer. So I'll tell you that right now. We're going to come back from the break, and I will give you guys as much of a heads up as I can. I'm finishing up Resident Evil tomorrow. Dave and I are probably doing some Warzone tomorrow. And then we're on a break from, from live streaming. We'll come back, and there'll be some gaming streams. Beer Meal will take a bit longer of a break. Oh, I didn't do that? it. I thought I was going to do it. Hold on. Did you mute, Jay? Uh, yeah. Yeah, you can yeah. tell. Look, there's like spittle on his shirt. No, oh, I washed yeah. my hands, and I did it kind of messily. Oh, okay. You look yeah. great, though, Shay. You got that good, messy hair look. Yeah. You oh, look yeah. Good. Thank you. Yeah. Wow. And that Glad shirt that shirt fits your chest well. Looks like you've got pecs, and I know you don't. Oh, oh well, th thanks, man. I appreciate that. Do I do feel pecs? a lot better after that, though. Oh, yeah. No, I, I yeah. Uh, that's what I was thinking too, Sage. What are you guys going to rate down ability? Um, <laughs> I don't even, you know. I know what I'm going to give it. I'm assuming. Yeah. That's exactly where I'm at. Yeah, I already gave it a zero. And everyone in the chat was like, you can just give them zero out of tens while they're puking. I was like, yeah, that's a good point. Fair enough. Zero out of ten. There it is. All right, and now... Final grade. So for final grade, we're gonna pick our favorite beer. Um. Oh, I'm going with the speed penis. Yeah, I'm going, sorry, speed, yeah speed it's Pilsner. the Pilsner for sure. <laughs> okay. I don't think anyone wants a speed penis. Uh, I like. Well, I, I, guess, I prefer that name. Isn't that just a Sibian machine? Yeah, I'm going with the uh, Speed River Pilsner as well. Um, can I get a Speed River Pilsner, please? Yeah, really, I've, thank you I've to Saskia, my I've wife, up, for giving me the beers. Thank you very much. I've used up all my goodwill in this one episode. I'm, spe I got a speed I'm, spe cock. I'm spending our time off just getting. I got the I got the back. speed cock on the waterfall. Yeah, hell yeah! This is I'm getting the speed cock as well. So this speed is cock. final grade. Time to see how well Sleem and Beers of Summer summer selections would do, seasonal selections would do. Uh, yeah, yeah, at the diplomas. Let's do it. Speed cock. Oh, that's good. That's even better after doing that. I'll kick us off. So right away, I like the artwork, especially on the box. Um, <laughs> the box is yeah, the best the artwork. Each can, the I like the uniform. The, the problem with the cans is kind of weird because it does. Feel, I wish this. I wish two point oh was the same as everything else. Because everything else, I loved how it was slightly different color, slightly different artwork, and then it gave yeah. a description. And I got to say, the descriptions were pretty much to the T what you got. So yeah. artwork's good, but the uniformity of it all could have been uh, worked out a little bit. But other than that, it's kind of no. what we all look for. Like, that's what we usually look for in our artwork. It tells you about the beer. Uh, uh, looks the like The artwork is time. pretty much what you got. That means if you drink spirits. Speed cunt, uh, sorry, speed, <laughs> what, speed river, uh, you have to be in utter panic and, and agony. No, no, but I mean, it's like it, like it gives you a good description of what it is. Speed river, two guys rushing to their demise over a waterfall. <laughs> gives you a description, the color looks great. What more could you want? Yeah, that's true. Okay. You know what I mean? All right, Dave, give us taste. Oh man, what can I say, man? It was a plethora of flavors, it was, yeah. Yeah, it was a it yeah. was a veritable charcuterie board of alcoholic beverages. I went from rainwater beer to honeycock, uh, and then and then a little. No tree wonder sap. honey brown's your favorite because in your mind you call it honeycock. So uh, no, but you get honey, you get sappy, you get tree sap, you get yeah, honey. Stop talking about that. Huh? Well, you were talking about pre-cum and then honey. I just think it's all mixing together in my brain. The images. I didn't I say pre-cum. I never said pre-cum once during this uh, in, in taste intro. Oh, yeah, no, okay. Now. Oh, okay. All right. During, yeah, okay. during our time, I've said pre yeah. <laughs> During the entire time I've known you, I've never heard that ter term used more in my life. pre -cum. That's true. Anyways, it's, it's slept on. pre now, the word pre-cum is slept on. All right. So now you said it twice in your taste thing, so. Yeah. Should yeah. Dave taste. Um, but, yeah, it, there's a lot of flavors coming out of this, Sleeman. Great. Uh, Johnny would be... I don't know if John would be disappointed or proud how much flavor fucking bombs are they're, they're pumping out. Well, of the, what's the average for you? Is it is it is the is it average? Is it skewed towards I like all the flavors, I dislike more of the flavors. What is it? 
Uh, no, I just don't understand. Oh, they're all so far apart from each other. It's, I don't get what okay, they're... Okay, one by one. Do you, like, do you like the flavor of 2.0? No. Okay. So oh, like but the... for a 2.0, I did. For okay. a low-calorie beer, I guess it's okay. Okay, and then did you like the flavor of, of the IPA? No. Okay, did you like the flavor of the honey brown? Yes, I would drape my body in that and lie in the sun. Oh, God, I would too, so long as the vultures came for your fucking corpse. Uh, did you like the flavor of Speed River Pilsner? Speed River, I'd go, yes. So overall, you like the flavor of the pack? Yeah, except for, except oh, for yeah. Except point. Yeah, I guess you're right. So yeah, overall, okay. yeah, overall, can... taste isn't bad. It could be better, but three out of four, not bad. Yeah, thanks for the, uh, thanks for guiding me through. Yeah, you're welcome. <laughs> I can't wait to be your fucking Sherpa right off a cliff. Uh, Shay, smoothness for the pack. What do you think, like, overall, how's, how smooth is it? Yeah, I don't know. I mean, like, the IPA and the Honey Brown, uh, even though I like the Honey Brown, I don't know if it's the most smooth. I also, for a low-calorie beer, didn't actually find the clear 2.0 to be that smooth. I think the Pilsner is smooth as fuck, though. Yeah, it's good Pilsner's shit. smooth as fuck. The others are not. Yeah, so I'd say overall, not that smooth. If you're looking for smoothness, don't get this pack. Okay, so overall, slow burn for the beers. Yeah. Gotcha. I think most okay. packs are like that, though. I okay. don't think you can get a smooth mixer pack of beers. You definitely can, so long as it's not this. Uh, now, down <laughs> ability is a hard one to figure out. We down two out of the four. I think the... The, the best case scenario for this pack on paper would be the 2.0 and that was really tough to do and not enjoyable and then we did what I thought was the worst one and that 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 came out to be true so <laughs> yeah. I would say for down ability the Pilsner might be good yeah but, maybe but, but just the, maybe. maybe the other three are not good so down ability wise if you could sucker someone into trading you for like an old Milwaukee or a PBR or Canadian or any other kind of regular beer, you'd be in better shape. Are you gonna be okay? No, I'm not. I'm about to like either puke or burp or foam or whatever. But none of the, not a good down ability. No. Now reliability, Dave. Can you count uh, on this pack to get you through a house party? <laughs> um, no. But you'd hand them all out to someone else and then get another drink. Can I? Would you though? Because I got to say, I'm feeling pretty good. Are you feeling pretty good? Yeah, I'm feeling I mean, great, but I would not go to a fucking house party with a 12 pack, a, a mixer pack, and then drink it all myself. But to I'd be, be fair, like, hey, you want to be, try this flavor? So, to be fair, though, you said that the taste was good for three out of the four. So, could you take this there and then maybe no, I know, trade out? No, I never be able to drink it all. No one would, in the right mind would bring a mixer pack to a party without saying, hey, try this flavor, try that yeah. flavor. Yeah. Yeah. You're looking for popularity points, you're not looking to get pissed. Yeah, exactly. Because you're giving up beers. Right. Okay, I get it. Yeah. So based on that, Shay, what's your final grade overall for this mixer pack? Uh, let's see what I gave it. Five, four, six, eight. Who do uh, we appreciate? Yeah, I don't know. I think overall I'll give this a nice just slap a C plus on this boy. <laughs> oh, slap, slap a, C plus. a C plus on this boy. <laughs> yeah, absolutely. Great. You know, you're gonna make a great dad. Um <laughs> Slap a C plus right on the ass, huh? Yeah, I right like yeah. a sticker. Oh. Hmm. Honestly, yeah, Shay, you nailed it because it got me pissed, but it was a hard fought battle to get there, and one that I was I was brought to kicking and screaming. So I'm gonna give it a C plus as well because, like, in a pinch, if I were to reconfigure this like a Rubik's in a pinch, cube, I drink the whole box, take a yeah, dab in like, a bush, like a, a Rubik's cube or a Tetris game. I could configure it in such a way that it would mitigate any kind of negativity I'd have around the beers that are absolutely horrific, which there are a lot of. But actually. Actually, I'm gonna give it a I'm gonna give it a C C I'm gonna give it a C minus. Oh yeah, that's fair. The reason I'm giving it a C minus is because it says it's a summer pack, and two of the four oh, are not summer yeah, beers. Oh yeah, that's a good point. And I and I hate the honey brown. So C minus for me. C minus. I'm giving it a C. Oh, we got all the C's. You know what? You're just taking an easy route. Uh yeah, I didn't know what to do. And then you, know you look at ours, know and you're do? like, you know what? I'll do the middle. I know you. I'm surprised I gave it the highest. No, I guess I enjoy That's precisely. A that, no, yeah, Jay, that makes sense because you're wrong a lot of the time. So uh, uh, Daryl says yourself, C Trevor. plus, 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 plus. Liam says I'm on the edge of falling off the I'm, – I'm on the edge of falling of the edge of the edge of the world to quote, to quote, to quote Black Sabbath. Um, 
Gomi says, as always, Shay is the Shakespeare of grading terminology. Thank you. The oh, Daryl says the Shakespeare. That's pretty good. Like Shay and then Dad. Uh, Shakespeare. I like that. One stump one. Thank hey you. boys, I miss you tonight. Leafs game went to overtime. We lost to the Frogs. The pills were trying. I hated the IPA. The Pilsner is worth trying. It's really good. One someone says drink drink twenty eight mostly Canadian bottles here in Sudbury, Ontario, forty four bucks. That's a great price. Uh Daryl says Pills was the favorite overall. You are not wrong, my guy. Gomi said nice. Yeah, hell yeah. Uh, uh oh, okay, Daryl. I already got that. Uh Rossi said speed cunt L O L. sorry, I didn't mean to say that. That was a rude <laughs> word I said. That's fine. <laughs> Guys, once again, and as always, thank you so much for watching Beer Me. Um, as we've said a couple times tonight, and as, as most of you, hopefully all of you know, we're going on a bit of a break. Uh, I'm back tomorrow finishing off Resident Evil. Uh, and then I think Dave and I are going to be doing some Warzone tomorrow as well. And then we're on a, a real break from all streaming for a couple weeks. Beer Me will be making a comeback uh, sometime soon. It'll be hopefully... Hopefully by the like sometime in June, but the longest wait you will have to to endure is to July first. We're definitely back one hundred percent on Canada Day, uh, and then we have some fun stuff planned over the summer. Schedule is going to switch up a bit. Uh, don't expect every Saturday to be a live stream, but when we come back, we will let you guys know exactly what's going on. Uh, but we really appreciate you guys. Like it's been it's been a crazy year and a half. We're we're going to be back to normal beer me's as well so you guys are going to be seeing some traditional beer reviews um and we're going to kind of find a, a new normal for the show so uh yeah have a great couple weeks at the very least we'll see you guys soon we love you very much uh, yeah yeah dave's gonna keep practicing his cold play and and dave and i'll be back tomorrow with with some with some gaming streams so if you guys are there for that then we'll see you there but uh yeah we love you guys uh have yourselves a great night we appreciate you thanks so much as always and we'll see you soon. Always wait for the back. Thank you. All right. Front bye -bye. to back.